Good morning. Thank you, Calmness Wizard, for the uh, 77 months. This offline sub guy. What was I doing? Oh, I was killing the Loch Ness monster. Oh, the fucker just won't die properly, man. It's okay, I'll get him. I need one of his circulators. And then I can make my next bow. And then I fully upgrade that bow. And then I think the game will actually be playable in terms of damage. I dodged that, but sure. You take those. Oh, that's what's happening. It's bugged again. This hotkey came back after every game restart. Jesus, I didn't even see what attack he was doing. So fast. Uh. How did that hit me? Let's be real here, man. the fuck? What? It's literally going through it. Look at the arrow, it's in it and it missed.
many hours did I sleep? I slept like a good six or so. It's usually good enough for me. Okay. leash him too far because it's gonna reset on uh, damage taken I can pick up some heals at least here I think it's going up like why is going up playing PoE he said it was gonna play DD which was detonate dead but then it's fucking dragon's dogma instead He died on EU lag servers and gave up. Oh no, dude. See the attack in time. I didn't see it in time. Max out on heals first. I can carry what, like six more heals? No, it's 30 heals in total, so 18 more heals. Oh, uh, 12 more heals. Okay, well, I recognize the animation finding on that attack. He goes up and then a wave comes down. Nah, that attack is pretty bullshit because it's super hard to see as a projectile. It blends in too much with the environment. I always think in games, if there's anything that ever one-shots you, it has to be like super, super obvious. Like you need to be absolute 100% sure that when you see that attack, you die to it. You know, your whole brain just goes like, holy shit, you know, I'm dead if I get hit by this. Okay, this is it. I think the strat is I use the canisters to remove his water guns and to remove his uh his back piece. Wait, what the fuck? Where did I go? Oh, oops. I remove his back piece and I remove his tail. I think that removing the tail helps in terms of hitbox. Thank you, Phoenix Left, for the 89. First non offline stop here in months. Thank you very much, man. I hope you're doing great. I'm not playing on 30 FPS, no. I checked the vaults for it. It doesn't help that much. Like, it gets less blurry, sure, but I think just watching in 30 FPS is worse than uh, watching it in fluid 60 FPS and then there's more blurry spots. I just tried it out. It didn't work well. 
Lancelot, thank you for the 29. We don't big fan, thank you 300 bits. <laughs> Take care, dudes. <laughs> I just need to knock out one shot in this fight. That is like the whole thing. It's the roughest part in the whole game because the difference between one shot and two shot is in, in two shot I can tank like what 35 more hits? In one shot I can't. I'm just dead. It's a huge difference. My arrow went off. The fuck. I went off again. One extra arrow on the non good bow. Oh, my God. It's more than needing accuracy in this game. The weapons are just horribly inaccurate in this.
I'm gonna kill all the mobs eventually. I don't know when I'm gonna fight the turtle though. I'll see. I think the entire hitbox for that attack is in front of him. Oh my god. Okay, that clipped me pretty hard. Jesus. Long button! No. Oh my god! No. What the fuck? Hey, yes, there's. They KS to me! I didn't drop again. Maybe the porch I ripped off. Let's see. Sixty-nine percent chance to drop. Oh, did it not give X because they killed it? Really? There's no way, right? Search crab. They actually just showed up at the last second and cast me. Damn, it's unlucky. Well, I guess it's not too bad. Two times 69% chance lost. Well, at least if I need other parts from him, I'll have them. <laughs> I'll have them all. Oh, it's so ridiculous if they really stole my XP there. Because this boss gives like 2.4k or something. Or 2.2k, I don't remember exactly how much. That is such a design flaw in the game. Like more than anything else so far that I've seen. If it's an MMO, it makes sense. The thing is, MMOs do it even better because a lot of MMOs have like a damage threshold you have to reach to get any XP at all. 
And then you get the portion based on damage dealt usually in a lot of MMOs. Somehow MMO did it better than a single player game. I wonder if uh, I'll, I'll just go back and forth between like two different places. Just to be sure. Thank you Indonesian for the 41. Yeah, that whole fight is like a tenth of a level or something per kill. Well, at least I think I got the fight under control now. Medium range seems to be the way after I kill the guns. I think it just comes down to the devs also just not playing this difficulty mode. That event probably doesn't happen much that NPCs join you since mobs die really fast in anything but this mode. How's the game thus far? I think it's an okay game. Out of machine muscles, wow. That's the first time I've run out of a mat of anything. Okay. Oh wow, that takes long if I'm not using that one. Yeah, I might have something to stash. I, po I probably do. I really doubt that they use everything. Jeez, that's some last one. Oh my god, his head is in the fucking wall. Actually, why am I shooting this one first? that I miss. Hey, look, it's in it! It's straight through the middle, in it! Shit, he still has his water gun. Oh my god. That gap close.
Okay, now the annoying part, because I don't have the Ripper arrows this time. How about I close it? Shot it. Okay, that works. That worked way better than expected. Okay, got it. Yeah, the hitbox is in the front. It's very misleading. Oh my god. That attack is really rough. I I'm not sure how to dodge it. Besides it's being out of range. I think it's last second direction change. The, the fins don't even do damage when they touch you. It, it's really just gi a giant hitbox on his head. Oh shit. I forgot the tails had a follow up. Like this attack. Oh my what? Okay, man. Okay. What is... Okay, the hitbox is somewhere behind him too, I guess. But that one's sort of invisible. I have to like stay in between him or something. In the middle parts. And dodge through him. Because the air behind him does damage. Okay. Let's fucking go. Let's see if he drops it. Circulator! Let's fucking go, I got it. I can make the bow. I tried took a while? Yeah, it's because of the difficulty mode. The difficulty mode halves elemental buildup. And it halves, um... The bonus damage you get when you tear off a part. And they get 100% extra more HP on top of the 200% they already get from the previous hard modes. And they nerf my damage by another 10% or so. 
from uh, seventy percent to sixty percent. So yeah, effectively they're about three times as tanky, I think. I don't think it's that big on some of the mobs. But then these guys is pretty rough. Especially when they have one shots. A little hard to see. That's why I don't want to try the turtle yet. Because the turtle also has that one shot rocket that it's super hard to see and it's like instantaneous almost. Like if the projectile's in the air, it's already too late. I, I have to preemptively dodge it. Uh, where do I go? South. A lot of games make difficulty more tedious than hard, yeah. It's always strange because I find that there's a lot of examples of how to make difficulty goods. And then I feel like a lot of devs, they just kind of close their eyes and they go like, ah, oh, fuck, I just alter some numbers. And the funny things about this game is that they actually add some really cool difficulty changes that aren't tied to numbers. Like mobs attacking at the same time and out of your vision. And uh, AI being like a little bit smarter and stuff like that. And then they added numbers on top of it. Did I find a raccoon? I haven't. Oh, actually, I think I found one. And there's some really, really cool ways to make fights harder. I think Crisis has a, one of the better examples. In Crisis, mobs, they flank more. And they stop speaking English, they speak Korean, so you can't tell what they're doing, whether they're flanking or backing or going forwards. And they don't get tankier, they still die in one shot. There's no, they're more numerous though. What if you're Korean? Well then, <laughs> that difficulty doesn't work on you. But yeah. Most people in the world aren't Korean or don't speak Korean. It's a pretty small percentage, all things considered. Oh, I need money. Oh, it's fine, I think. I have lots of things to sell. Oh, I can sell, like, all the green weaves, I think. I don't think I'm using any of them. They're just, like, wasting my fucking space and fucking my visibility. Let me check. Like, I'm never using these elemental coils, for example. There's no way. They're way too specific. Okay, well, let's make the weapon. Check the difference. Double damage on tearing parts. I won't have uh, cheap ammo ammo at all, right? What is the other shot even? Oh, that is a special ammo. Okay. Bonus damage on knockdown too. This is the way, right? This is the way. I killed the Lapras twice just now. I kind of learned the whole damn fight. So I can play it... Well, I wouldn't say near perfect, but it's alright. Oh, wow. High tier weapons are so good that they even get an extra tier for upgrades. Okay. Now we need a roller back hammer tool and stalker stealth generator. There's fucking invisible mobs in the game. Holy shit. All right. Yeah, I killed one squirrel. That's not even the one I need, no? Which one's the regular... Quiver?
This one. Raccoons. Okay. Let's kill a few of these. <laughs> it's the mo my most used bow and I don't have a single upgrade on it. Well, the weapon is an upgrade. The sharpshooter. Do I care? I don't even have like the mats to use this properly, man. I'm out of machine muscles. Oh, the mech's out again. No, oh, no. Feels like a waste. I think I'll just wait for a purple ball for that one. You don't get why there's no guns in this futuristic setting? Because it's not necessarily futuristic for these guys. They are humans who have been uh, reborn again, basically. And they're relearning all of technology. And they're pretty much still in the fucking Stone Age from how it looks. I should be using the probe outfit. I switched earlier to get the poison rest out. Let's kill a couple raccoons. And I don't even know if I can find those mobs. Because they might just be hidden still. Oh, did I, not, I didn't set the job. Oops. Fuck, I never know where anything is in this place. It's a cross over there. Okay. The min max of the rest in this game? Don't know. I, I don't care too much about damage reduction in this game. I just need to be have enough to not get one shots. Because like I said earlier, not getting one shot is the difference between tanking 30 hits and tanking one hit. You can always heal after getting hit. I saw coins character in uh, Dragon's Dogma. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, I have the location of the stalkers. It's here. Jeez, I'll never get used to these button presses. <laughs> it's bizarre, right? You go to a campfire, fast travel with mouse 4, then you click with X, and then you confirm with spacebar. <laughs> what the fuck? I should start using the foods more too. Although they don't last that long. Like 3 minutes. The fights are like 15 or something. 3 layer misclick protection. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, I think it goes up from this side here. It's annoying that Aloy can't cook. You'd think she'd just be able to cook in a campfire. Air like blood. Oh. You must be the champion. Please. Oh, there's a bow merchant here. Your actions are known across the lowlands. You've aided our marshals and our chief. I, for one, am grateful. So I'll tell you what. 
What I see, what I know, I will share. That way, you won't be running blind. I should probably tell you. There's been reports of rebel outposts all over the jungle. A few set up camp just west of here. A whole squad's hiding out in the south. They've even managed to take over an area southwest of here, where the jungle narrows. Those traitors don't know when to give up. And our squads are at their limit. We could really use the help of a proven champion. I'll see what I can do. Is the storyline good? It is. I think the main story is really, really good. The characters are not. But yeah. Can't have everything, I suppose. A barrage, blast wing. Oh, I actually have enough for this if I want it. Explosive damage, draw speed, overdraw damage. Nah, I think I'll skip. A huge armor in this one. Really nice things too. This is one of the best stats I've seen on a weapon, on an armor, I mean. Oh, I was comparing to the wrong one. What the fuck? Don't I have this one equipped? Yeah. It's bugged. It's a lot better than my current one. It's only worse in melee defense that I do care about, but all these skills are super good. Ah, fuck it, defense over anything else, I think. You breathe the machine, huh? This guy? Huh? Do low health skills do? They pluck when you're low health. I think low health is 30% in this. Alright. They're called stalkers, so I think they're invisible. scandal <laughs> okay so they drop landmines and they fire lasers ah, champion Won't you sit for a moment? it's not one shot it's two shot i think which is fine it's no biggie it's a very fast projectile but it's uh it's got a good audio cue on it so maybe it's not that bad Oh, they were in the trees. Bro, I can see you. How does this cannot work? Oh, there we go. No, it scanned the fucking bird. Oh, oh, fuck, dude. Detach from tear damage. Okay, so it's the top part. Cloaking device is on the side, I think. I can't tell. Reinforcements caller and what is this? Powerful weapons to launch mines on his ass. Okay, so I just need to kill the top part. Okay, I just learned that the game plays already before you get to see your screen for like one second or so. Oh, that only removed his weapon? Okay, it did not. Okay! No audio cue for that one. <laughs> Holy shit! Come, 
I have news. Oh, I didn't check the weakness. This game feels really polished compared to DD2. I feel DD2 is more polished. Mostly because that game has much, much cleaner hitboxes. thing about DD2 is that that game has performance problems, right? For a lot of people. And those will eventually get fixed. Probably. This one has hitbox issues, which they'll probably never fix. I know they won't because they didn't fix the ge first game ones either. All the difficulty in Ultra is really polished here. I disagree. I don't think uh, it changes hitboxes going from Ultra Hard or Easy Mode. Yeah, in Performance Mode, you're completely right. This is very, very polished in Performance. It's not falling for it, man. I hope this is the laser cannon. It wasn't. Holy shit, the one all the way in the back shot. From Invis. It wasn't the laser cannon? I'm not sure. It was hard to say. I can pick it up? Oh yeah, I think you're right. I don't think I want to pick it up. <laughs> I think I need the move speed in this fight. And damage is not really an issue. It showed in the UI? I didn't see where. I don't usually have time to look at texts. Did you see that? He wasn't even looking at me. There goes the What is that bloom? I see he's right there on the dot. Oh, no wonder. There's some shit gun. Was it this part? I don't know what part it is. I think it's three of them, right? Because I shot off two guns. This one still has a gun.
a dangerous fight. But I don't know why they're like on that goat. I don't even think I'm leeching them. They just have a really weird behavior. They try to re-engage, but they don't have the stealth. Wow, huge XP on these guys. Half the XP of the fucking Loch Ness monster. Machine can't move. I could grapple in for a big hit. Nothing left. Actually, there's the mine layers. Oh, that's new. Holy shit. Okay. That's a pretty cool fight, these guys. I need to find a roller back. I don't, I don't think that's happening until I scan the tower. I already am playing the new Peary League, yeah. I'll play some more there today too. I'm gonna get my build going, but I'm not sure how I wanna approach my builds. If the spells turn out to be bad, I think I'm just gonna go try mana stacking since it's a newly buffed thing. Seems cool too. I'll see, I'll see. Ballista seemed to be hard to go for as a hero friend. I didn't realize how little Aji there was on that side of the skill tree. Let me get a new bristle back. I need a mount. The Loch Ness monster killed my previous mount, the fucker. Like it's a slippery slope. I see it more as a learning experience. I never tried mana stacking before, so. It would be nice to try it for the first time. Okay, it's not allowed to see me. Legendary is a max tier equipment, yeah. Or, at least I think so. In the first game, it was legendaries. Maybe they had another tier in this. Halfway? No, not really. I'm already on epics. There's one more tier. Oh, what? This one showed up instead?
All right. This tall neck is still locked. I did the one down here. It didn't give me the location of the mob. I guess I can do the main quest a bit because I think the main quest always sends you along the path of a tall neck. I do have a nice bow now. Okay, let's do main quest like one of them. Oh yeah, I was almost done with this one even. I think it's like the last part. Thank you, Paddles on the 33, Indy JJJJ, Fangler 28, Even on Fire, Fangler 36, Dota win, and we're gonna play Dota when the new patch comes out, man, which should be mid-April. No raccoons? Fuck, you're right. Let's upgrade my pouch, like, once. Where are them raccoons at? Here? Fucking hell, they just stopped spawning, or what, since the beginning of the game? Okay, let's kill like 10. Maybe I can upgrade my project two or three times. I can't use cheap arrows to hunt anymore. <laughs> Only expensive shit now. So I could probably put my bow on one of these. Oh, I could put it on... Fuck, I need the lightning from this and the ice from this. I guess fuck the sharp shooting bro. The elusive raccoon. These guys, by comparison, like everywhere. The Haram pig. I needed these two for something. Holy shit, it fucking exploded. Using the right arrows? Oh, they flipped them around. What the fuck? Why is my YouTube on streaming POE? What do you mean? What are you talking about? <laughs> it's literally streaming right to zero dawn. Watching a replay? I already looks skinny in these areas. There's too much shit. And coders don't like small, uh, many small parts.
They don't always drop their hide even. Fuckers. Oh, I need to try to use the... Um, the rope caster skills. I have like one of them that just pulls them and one of them that just straight up catches them once, I think. Once per fight. Once per mob. Everything's thoroughly soaked. What the fuck? Bro. What? What? How's he alive? J. J. Wishbone. Okay, let's kill one more raccoon and I'm done with this for now. No way. We lost. Fucking eight birds, man. A workbench somewhere next to each other. Oh, there's this one here, I think. On the camp. Yeah, this one. Can fast travel? Oh. Every time I'm this game, I'm collecting stuff? I mean, that's the whole gameplay loop. <laughs> you collect stuff to upgrade shit. I think it's pretty relaxing overall. I need rabbits next. What the fuck? For some reason, fast travel is disabled. Now it works. The fuck? It's weird. It's kind of like all the new AC style games. Yeah, it's very, very similar. It's more like, like Ubisoft style games even.
Okay, it's here. Done. Another random animals. Oh, there's a campfire here too. Well. I'm not upgrading my weapons right now. I'm upgrading my uh, pouches. Salmon? Well, it's a big upgrade too, this one. 30 to 45. Now let's just do it real quick, because I use a lot of these arrows. It's cheating. It's chosen fog of war. You can't convert everything into mounts. So far, I've only seen two. What's maybe three that can turn into a mount? The fuck is this pathing? Let me go around. Okay, where is? I'm just. I'm going directly towards it. No one is this. I think it's this place here. What? Okay. I guess I need to spear them. I just took his fucking bones. They're quite rare. 
Oh, I can scan in the water. Wow, in the water, I mean. Well, I don't know what that is, but I'm, I'm fucking, I'm fucking killing it. And now. Slaughter spine? The fuck is a slaughter spine? Amos is on or off? I don't think there's Amos on this difficulty. <laughs> there's no choice even if you want to. Oh, Peckery is a boar. Level 45. Goodbye. Nice to meet you. Goodbye. Fuck, there's no campfire anywhere in this whole zone? Die? No, I'm good. I'm good. Fast travel is disabled. That's because I'm dropping a lot. Actually, there's no workbench here, is there? They'll probably send me to one eventually. What's this place? Oh, what? There's a hunter set of thingy here. It's fucking trash. Well, oh, these are really cheap. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within. The core cool route should be starting soon. Once it's done, I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaro's throne. And Ether. Outlander, the Chief awaits you in the arena, past the throne. must lead to the arena. It's another part of the ruins. Turned into a fighting ring. Look at them all. Let the machines fall. Three. I don't think I'm playing no less for the wicked now. Hmm. To knock martial armor. It's a complete fucking joke armor set? Okay, I see why these tribes don't win against anything. Aloy. It seems you've had to move mountains to bring the Sky Clan to heal. Literally. Katalo helped. Yes. Takote reprimanded for all the clan to see. You both served well. But now the cool route is at hand. Some have come to compete, others to bear witness. They know Regala will come for me. I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end as long as you remember yours. So what's the plan? Katalo, 
There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool route with machines, she will have to attack by the trail. You will join our defenders there. Hold the line, and I'll have my marshals. You will be free of my service and receive your reward. Make whatever preparations you must. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. Let's get this over with. Good. You'll find Decca at the North Barricade with the rest of our defenders. Strike true as the ten. I'll see you when this is done. More than courage. Peccary Heinz. Were Peccaries not uh, boars? Or they different, maybe. We're different, yeah, okay. Fuck. Is there no button to refill everything? <laughs> the ceremony. The memorial the my rope weapon. And I have this. I did not mean to use it like that actually. I, remember my last trip to the hunting grounds. <sighs> I don't even know what the hotkey is for it's. Is it this one? Is this not a rope caster? Trip caster is different from a rope caster. Oh shit. No wonder. Your enemy is oh. What about the other skill then? This one. That's this one. I still don't have it. Okay. Well, it is what it is. I'm back to just using huntable weapons uh, and pretty much nothing else. And I think there's no blastling to skill tree anywhere. Stay here at Okay. Hikaro's defenders should be at the end of this trench. We are not alone in this fight. Oh. Focus on the machines. Take them down. And Regala's forces become no different from our own. Yes, Chaplain. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed.
Our soldiers are ready. They will defend the cool route from below. But from above... Not bad. Where did you get it? One of our squads ripped it off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our teeth. Cool Root is upon us! Our struggle demands new blood! New leaders! Release the quarry! Challengers! Approach! Take down a machine shall be named Marshall. That's why the Marshall is so shit. Strike from the air as they did and see. They kill like one small machine and they call them Marshalls. No wonder. What is this? Defend the cool route. So I feel like every second projectile just kind of disappears into thin air.
the NPCs with zero DPS. Oh, there's one stuck. Super when they send like seven soldiers to protect the entire tribe. armor Dude, they're gonna be exhausted before they start to fight climbing that shit Level 28 Slater Fang. Let's see. Destroy it to remove the Sonic Blast. Tear off for collecting. Plasma Arrow don't have it. Leave intact. The heart. Shock Arrow parts. Perch Water parts. Acid arrow parts. Tear off the assholes. Exposed hearts. Lift the perch with up. Use the power all shock it. I can't see what it is though. What is this? Shock orb. Now 
What's his weakness? Ice, fire, and other things. I'm not sure if he's gonna move forward here. How much you build up? Okay, I did nothing. Okay, the weak spots are whatever. Look, looks like I'm just shooting it into a dice, like always. bone or whatever can't sprint dude what the fuck is happening in this See the attack. Hold on, champion. We're really Let me lower brightness, man. I can't see shit. The fuck is brightness even? Let's be on graphics then. Can't change brightness here, what? Ah, shit. Oh my god, I can't see anything. What is going on, dude? Jesus Christ, what is this? What am I looking at right now? What even hit me? They definitely have to zoom out this fight a bit more. What the 
that hell is weak. I think the boss fight here is the camera. Holy shit. Every time it's close, you just can't see anything. switching this dude Get me the fuck away from this thing. Oh no. Shockwave attack, I think. Reloading! 
What's even left? Oh, the cannons is on the side. Only vulnerable when extended. And it's random parts, okay. And the back is really weak, apparently. Oh, the tail has stuff. Okay, that's some attack. All right. That's new. It's weird, I don't see the canisters anymore, anywhere. Maybe they're the tracks? the hardest fights finally I hate those things but Gala went after Hikaru and Katalo I gotta get to them dude there's something all the lightning in this place what is up with this?
Oh, what's the dynamic range? Where was the dynamic range? Display a little boxing. Oh, here. No, it doesn't work, man. What the fuck? Yeah, I don't know, dude. Is there something wrong with this place? And it's like fucking bugged or something. It's getting flashbanged by the whole arena at all times. Get everything. I think that fight needs like a zoom out of. Oh fuck. <laughs> of like a good 30% more from the character. And then the whole fight will be completely fine. But holy shit, man. When he's right next to you and he does his spin attack, whatever it is. Double kill? Oh no. This isn't finished. I'll be back with everything I have. And all who stand with Hakaro will be run red. Shoot her. <laughs> Scooby Doo as villain. You fought well. Prove yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. I name you all, Marshal. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. It's such a Scooby Doo ass story, man. Whenever I these guys show up. I should have finished with Dala. But now she'll be back with more machines. Stronger than ever. I'll do what I can to help. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called for. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then, but I believe in you now, so leave me. 
and get to your task. What will you do? Tend to the wounds. What you need is there. Take it. Your deeds today will be remembered like those of the ten. I don't even get like how three tribes together are weaker than like this one random rebel woman. Why they just breed destined to lose? This is it. Either is below. There. That console. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. They can use machines that three tribes can't? Guess so. So it means they're probably destined to lose though. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Restoring ether subordinate function to original code. Got it. Now to get this back to Gaia. The visions and the growth have changed. The words of this king are now future. Anyway, I like how they uh, resolve the plot point of how the marshals die so easily. They just appoint marshals to anyone. And this one just. Ah, uh, you won one fight, you're a marshal. One challenge, you're a marshal. Fought in an arena, you're a marshal too. Fucking everyone's a marshal. Same one, right? Yeah. The individual character writing is really bad in this game. It really feels like Scooby Doo shit. Holy America! The visions throughout the grove are different now. And this one, it, it just appeared. Is this your doing? The visions have changed. That's the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines. Scarcity of food and water. Storms that drive us from our homes. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. Leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction that when we are united, we can overcome any threat. They felt though, right? They're all dead. Join me. Join us in that conviction as we strive for a nation and a world without want or war. <clears throat> Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. 
So I will stand with you on your mission. Give whatever is left of my life. It is what I choose. How can I say no to that? So, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. Will do, Aloy. Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours? Should be interesting. All right, I need to get Ether back to Gaia. Seems like capturing it. Side quests. Holograms too. Oh, where's new town? Checking out. Okay. You should move. Regal is coming for Hikaru. Everything that happened, I feel like I need to do more. Blood of the Ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. We'll just have to remember them then. <clears throat> <laughs> well, thanks to you, the chief still lives. And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, Cabo. He was not counted among the dead. Which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task. <coughs> so my blade... ...is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. But Cabo is the last of my blood. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Kevo's squad went. Shall we head out? <clears throat> I have some other things to take. I'll wait for you. We'll make our... Until then. See you never, bitch. Champion, I fear we must lean on your strength and generosity again. Just tell it to her straight, Ducko. The tribe needs the arena. She's our only hope to getting it open again. You need the arena? But the cool route's over. That's true, but we also use the arena to boost the tribe's morale. We use it for training. Herd in machines so our soldiers can experience the glory of the kill in a controlled setting. Which, of course, boosts morale. But... Chief Hikaru won't let us reopen the arena until the ballista protecting the field is repaired. We need it in case a machine runs amok, and it was damaged during the cool route. The parts we need aren't easy to find. I get it. You need me to hunt down some machines and grab <clears throat> the parts. We'd ask. Let's see what level those quests are. Well, they're kind of low. Was it a different one? It's a different one. Fuck it, kill turtle! <clears throat> it's a level 15 quest. I'm, I'm gonna fuck I that turtle so in the ass. I like how I have the campfire behind it. Thank you, Plim the Human, for the 66 months of tier 2. Zach, thank you, the Prime. Howie Boy, thank you, the 40. And Moza, make it, thank you, the 61, man.
Can't stealth attack this, huh? I wonder if there's a jumping one. I want to try it. He knows. Nah, it's not happening, man. His nose is way too big. This is with the upgraded assets? And that's a triple shot. Okay, they don't one shot anymore. It's very doable. Oh my god, I can't see the projectors at all though. It's insane. Six damage per tick, so it needs about 5,000 ticks to kill. That's his weakness, by the way. See what's hitting me right now. I think it's the rockets. It's the rockets. <sighs> okay, I need to focus down those turrets over anything else. I don't think any of its other weapons matter at all. They didn't do anything at all. It's really just the rockets. Let me check if there's any canisters. I don't remember if you had any. Oh, this one. Shock. Uh, it's on the top, I guess. And the I don't see them though. Oh, I don't see them. Even on the armor, I don't see it. No. Hmm. Let me check again. Looks like it's under the shell here, so maybe I have to like clear the clamps, pop off the upper shell, and then shoot him? I don't know. Are there weak spots even? Oh, there are these. Energy shield shell fastens detach, they'll remove the shell and expose vulnerable components beneath. Alright, let's fucking go. Looks like I gotta peel him a bit first. Pretty cool. Dude, this fucking. Like this, this, this scanning thing wouldn't be so bad if it didn't have this auto aim thing that snaps onto it. Okay, the most tier damage I have is for my arrows, my regular bow. 
It's 150 per shot, the sniper is 280, but it's low rate of fire. That was a miss. Oh shit, that still hits. I see them. The lightning thing is. I fought this boss yesterday, but I never killed him. I went to go for better items. The fuck did it go? Oh, this weapon is some shit, right? It's some dog shit, I think. But the companion is taking it. Oh, fuck. This is an absolute piece of shit. Yo, AI took one of the compartments. <laughs> Okay, let's 
see if I can hit one of those lightning spots. It looks hard, no? I don't think I can go up there. We need high ground over him, but... I go high ground those lockers while we talk coming up. Oh, I see one. Oh, oops. Wrong button. Got it. Lucky. Oh my god, what the hell hit me? Oh wow, you get so many hits off this? Uh, I don't know what I'm looking at right now. Oh, it's dead. Well, that was easy. Gotta say, feels good to hunt by your side again. Come on, let's head into the tunnel. Looks like a cave in. Let's look around. Having high tier damage bow is like the main thing to play for, isn't it? Since elemental damage is halved. Or elemental buildup is halved. It's like the main damage for me is just directly hitting them. There's like no proper alternative. It's all in impact damage and nothing else. Kinda lame though. Like I would like to play into their weaknesses, but then <laughs> it's like sure man. I poison the guy whatever, acid the guy and then there's nothing. Some kind of code to open. Doesn't look like there's anything I can do now. Bunch of Osram supplies. A dead end. There's not much else in here. Better head back to the main tunnel. Hello, it's a fucking guy in there. Talana, I think I found something in the rubble. What is it? <sighs> the shock still stuns them and forcing you to damage, but the buildup is so slow that, like, when you do normal damage, you just end up being faster usually. What does it say? I think the only He's exception is when it is like purely armor familiar. parts. Then though it ends abruptly, when the tunnel started to collapse, I guess. Oh. But there's nothing here about a Karja hunter. And an earlier caravan made it through before the collapse. Sounds like they went to a watering hole on the other side. So he could have made it. Is there another way through? I have a kind of base in the mountains north of here. There's a passage through it that will get us to the other side. Us? You know, Hawk and Thrush. We'll find your friend together. Head to the western outskirts of Plainsong. There's a path in the foothills there that leads up to the base. I'll make sure someone greets you there and shows you the way through. Then I'll meet you at the camp on the other side as soon as I can. Thank you, Aloy. I knew running into you would bring good luck. Here, take this. May it help on your own hunt. I'll see you at the camp. Zo, I ran into an old friend who needs to cross over to the west. Can you meet her in the foothills near Plain Song and show her the way? I don't think higher tier bow is going to help much. Yeah, There's already fantastic. epic tier at 160 build up. I think for it to be effective for brute forcing yes, reactions from uh, elemental, I, I need like 500, 600 plus. Tawana seems really worried about her for it to be ever to be worth it. Yeah, right now I'm just shooting canisters, but that's not really playing for elementals, is it? It's like when they get marked with weak to lightning, for example, and you do a lightning attack, it, it doesn't do anything. Okay, let's go here. I'm already using the advanced elemental arrows. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. Yeah, shit, man. Oh, oops. 
Thank you, Zuma, for the 190. I see you, champion. Sit. Slings have a higher buildup, but that I used the sling. <laughs> that was the sling for the acid buildup. I think if I fully upgrade it, maybe I could get it to like 250 ish. And then I can do like triple coils, like 30% more. So that make it like what, 300 something? I think that'd be okay, it'd be usable. I can't sprint anymore. Sprint! They want to give incentive to use other stuff. I think they really failed in that case. So far the best weapon I have is just the impact bow and then shooting weak spots and hope they die in time. And hope they don't end up weak spots uh, and you know forcing me to shoot them normally on the wiring and stuff. Damn, that doesn't loot and kill at the same time. It should. Did I need this for something? Oh, an Apex machine. Weak versus fire. Apex roller back level 35. There's two of them. Fuck, I can't see the color of the canister. What is that? It's chill water. Let's see these guys first. Okay, what do we do here? Tear off the armor. Cargo clamps. Heat vent at the top. Anti-gravity system used to attract and reattach armor plates. It's on the back, it seems. Glows red and overheated and becomes especially vulnerable to damage. Oh, the shock part at the bottom. That might make it easy. I could maybe change it on it into death. But it's like two of them. I think I will kill those two small ones and then leash them away and then go back and reset and try to kill the other ones. Oh, it's like fucking six mobs, man. It's six mobs here. Jesus, why is it still giving me the brittle tutorial like 30 hours in? Looks like those guys are on actually. Maybe I don't have to deal with them. No, my mount! Where's the lightning? There. It has a cover. The other one didn't aggro. My fucking mount! And then it just fucks off? What? Thank you. 
It's a very tiny mob. I didn't even see the attack. <laughs> okay, that's a one shot. I see you. Oh, I guess it's gone now, right? It was a rare Apex variant. You die to air very often in this game. Isn't it here? Different mobs now. Maybe it was further. Jeez, I'm surprised I'm still getting one shot even with epic armor. Maybe it was a damage that builds weak to the only place for it. Maybe from a recent storm. There are a few survivors on the overlook. We should see if we're okay. Is he alright? Uh, he will be. <sighs> there. Well, what about the others? Let me worry about that. Rest now. I'm Natika. You're a long way from the east, Outlander. You're in a Tika. So this must be bleeding mark. What's left of it? How do you know this place? The Inker's apprentice and Scalding Spear told me to find you. He was worried something happened to your supply caravan. Well, as you can see, we have more important problems than delivering ash blood. What happened here? The last storm caused a deluge that brought down half of the mountain. The mudslide barreled right through the village. As you heard, we have is worth it, man, for sure. I need to keep watch on these two. I can take a look around. If I find anyone, I'll send them your way. Much appreciated. And if you see an older soldier, Grimfaced goes by Kentok. I'll be able to use my focus on the survivors. Water feels thick, polluted. That rubble's blocking the base of the crane. Maybe I can clear it if I pull that beam out. Figure something out. Going down.
No, I think it's a different part first. Where is it? There. Uh, let's see how they go there. Oh fuck! Is pullable? No. Could look around with my focus. Oops. Maybe that one's last. Oh, I'm stuck on everything. There's the other one over there, I think. All of the projectiles. Mm -hmm. Need to be closer, I guess. Okay, let's look around. What is happening with the image here? Maybe the sharpshooter bow? Trying sharpshooter bow. Guess I try to go all the way up from there, maybe? Oh no. Really enough, I can't climb. No. Okay. Could use my focus here. Maybe this is close enough. <laughs> Wait, maybe it's this part. No? What? left I from above I guess would I recommend this game? Uh, only if you like the first game I would recommend you play the first game first and then see if you like any of that and if you don't then skip second game all together because it's really just more of the first one Okay. It is definitely not shooting that thing. Maybe it's... Can I get this? Can I glide and use the thingy? No, I can't. Oh my god. Well, the only thing I can think of is standing here and then pulling the thing up or something, but... It doesn't look like I can reach. Okay, let's look around. I 
I destroyed this part here. Uh, and that didn't really do anything. Maybe it's below? from that platform I mean, that is a very obvious platform get used to this. let's see Is this not the answer? Brittle cables vulnerable to projectile impacts. It must be. Something? Maybe. Whatever that is, I'm, I'm going there. I've tried sniper arrows too, they work. There's fire gleam on those rocks. Igniting it should clear the way for the plane. in place. No, I don't know it to reach the cliff. I should take a look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. That's so fucking stupid. <laughs> the fact that this didn't happen in the first shot is fucking stupid. Like, there should have been some kind of reaction. I don't know how you did it. Just walk away and give me my rewards. I didn't see anyone who looked like Kentok. Maybe he's with the other survivors. didn't freeze what the f oh my god what the fuck is happening oh jesus fucking christ let's re-approach Oh, 
I'm gonna check if there's any parts I can go for. Yeah, there's some unique parts on the storage and the till. And perch water for that. Leave the chest intact. Okay. I still don't have a perch water shot, do I? Oh no, I do. I have this one. Do these not count? It has to be a shot. Yeah, they don't count. Oh my god, do they? What the fuck is happening right now? It's a very small arena for five mobs, whatever this is. Jesus, the camera is rough on these mobs. <laughs> Holy shit, the tracking on those projectiles. Okay. Those mobs are some shit. Oh, what a shame the um, last thingy doesn't work on chill <laughs> on the chill water uh, canisters. I'm playing hardest difficulty, yeah. Don't play hardest difficulty in this game, it is not worth it at all. I'm 100% certain the developers did not play it themselves. They just put it out there. I'm gonna try it again, see, maybe I missed. No, the really doesn't work. Okay, well, that's very disappointing. Is that another weak spot for this? Jesus Christ, dude. Don't have enough family yet. That's like the roughest projector I've seen so far in the game. Crush him with the boulder. Shoot the support beam. I need to stealth kill the two fuckers. It's uh, six projectiles coming out. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Maybe I can stealth kill two with the natural traps here. This fight is not happening normally. Oh 
Oh fuck. The ejector really looks off. Something I got. Okay. Russia oh my god, he came up fast. You Holy shit. Me. Yeah, fucking hell, that dash is insane. It's like no damage. It's fucking four. It's like one volley of hits. No. Jesus, that hitbox. Such a weird hitbox on the tail attack. I didn't have vision of him. He was behind the other one and started his attack out of vision. Oh, what a shit tier arena too. It's too small.
Go back to stealth killing those two small ones. At least it made the fight playable. Oh god, I wasn't crouching. I died one shot. Okay. All right, not too bad. Was that a miss? No. I need to get Did he come? I was looking for him even. That's a long one. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's impossible when they both do it at the same time and in a different order because they shoot uh, on my predictive pathing so one shoots where I go and one will shoot where I don't go I'm just dead what the fuck is guaranteed death False cells don't work in those canisters. It needs to be uh, chill water arrows specifically. Not chill water bombs, not chill water traps, chill water arrows and nothing else. They have some of the, the hardest dashing attacks I've seen so far in the game. It's absurdly high damage and fast in this fast. 
Oh, there he is. I was looking just for you. They, they really charge from like the other side of the fucking arena and they travel in that time in like half a second or something cheese and from the boss i don't want that cheese dudes because if i win a cheese every fight in the game i might as well just use god mode and insta kill them when i look at them I shot off his hat. What the fuck? Oh my god. He hit his fucking face. These guys have some dubious hitboxes. Traps are consumables because traps don't do anything on this difficulty. Elemental buildup doesn't work because it's halved. So the main tool you get in this difficulty is just pure impact damage and nothing else. Fire and lightning. Now here, here's the lightning build up. Shit. Oh my god. I don't have time to use a trap. Oh, they have like a special pounce attack from the water, I think. It just went through him. Holy shit. Their weakness and their weakness on elements. Ah. Yeah, I need about uh, six traps to do it. Or oh, I can shoot them. Um, how many times? Probably 15 times. So you can see why I don't use any of the fucking traps. Especially when they're not alone. It's the only thing that matters. Nothing but impact damage matters. Did I ever switch the coils over? I don't think I did. On this bow. Oh no, I didn't. I can have like another 10% damage or something. 25% more damage against him. Ah, uh, it only works for one hit. 
Attempt some damage there. What is that menu? I think they just lowered elemental numbers so much that none of the uh, elemental reactions matter anymore. They're just not worth the time where you can shoot them 15 times instead for proper damage. Yeah, the fire damage is pathetic too. It's like two damage ticks or something, man. It's a complete joke. I'm not sure what the point is. Thank you, Toffee, for the 117. Xarum, thank you for the 30. Yeah, where's the other one? Where'd they even go? In the water or something? Oh yeah, this. The boulder platforms did like 400 damage. Oh my god. Which is about two arrow shots. It's probably worth doing if they're actually under it. Uh, but I think I'd rather just shoot them instead. Because impact damage. This is a pretty nice place to fight them, I think. I can kite them here. Oh. Okay. This one bug out too. Jesus, you see that hitbox? That was just insane. Completely insane. Oh my god, they went into the wall. The damage before he moved. Oh. 
I'm surprised that didn't hit. How did that not hit? an easy fight using proper strategy you call this an easy fight you call this a strategy i'm just brute forcing shots into a dice <laughs> how's the strategy also the other one bugged out completely it just disappeared into the air What is wrong with this mob? Can it die? Finally, 1000 XP for this. Oh, those are not worth healing off at all for resources, huh? These things? No, I think they're not worth it all. Oh no, the quest is to kill them all. Oh, dude. Oh, I found them. He might go back to his spot if I maybe leave the area and come back. I remember the Loch Ness monster went back to his spot eventually. Now he's inside the cliff. He like bugged out at some point. He was doing an attack and he went through the wall and then he just got sucked us. into it. Where are you? We're trapped in this tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay, I'll find a way. Let me go all the way out. What? Up? Where the fuck am I stuck here now? I hope this is far enough. I guess I might as well do this one first. It's probably on the wall there, right?
Take a dark spot to respawn. It's gonna suck if it's forever bugged. There's also some of the tankiest mobs so far too. They're pretty much as tanky as the... Oh my god, they all respawned, huh? Yeah, they all respawned. Okay, well, it is what it is, I guess. Holy shit. I'm just gonna destroy the sack below them too, fuck it. It's a shame the aggro in this game is linked. Instead of being awareness based. Silent Strike does no damage at all. It's like 200 or something. Oh my god, it's tail bumped into me. Like I said, the only meaningful damage in this game is regular arrow shots and weak spots. And the elemental um, canisters if you have the right ones. Oh, it saved the checkpoints, but also not my heals. Jesus, that hit box. Feel heals. I think these guys have the worst hit hitboxes of the whole game so far. I'm gonna upgrade my bow more. I forgot what the upgrade needed. Oh, right. I never found the hammer all the way back, whatever. I need a storage. My heels refill? No, I didn't. I'm still missing 18 of them. Sending him on fire does nothing, dude. It's a two damage DOT. And it takes a billion shots. I noticed the fire debuff in general is just horrible. At least, like, the acid one makes them vulnerable on some body parts. But the fire one setup does nothing. Next game after Horizon? I have no idea, man. I'm still just playing Horizon.
I don't have a meaningful way of doing fire damage and this is my best lightning damage this actually this one is 200 fire damage maybe it's okay let's see it is their weakness after all maybe we can get these fuckers one stuff from stuff oh my god okay maybe not Some shit. That one does not miss from that range, huh? These guys make the turtle look like a fucking joke. I'm not even sure it hit me the first time there. Oh, dude, that's like the best place to fight, but it bugs. Because I can funnel them in there. I guess I stay away from it in case it bugs again. Thing. Oh my God, I got stuck in the pillar. What? Ugh. I think I was grabbing onto it. Climbing inside it.
Food balls are worth it, I think, but they only last three minutes, and these fights are like 25 plus. So they're kind of pointless. I'm not sure what they were thinking when they were making food balls only last three minutes. Like, what a hassle. Friend. There's a skill tree for it too, yeah. Let's see. Oh. oh, I touched his tail. No, I can't walk there. Oh my god. Oh, that freezes in one go at least. Okay, I have like seven more ulti shots. Maybe we can kill him within the ulti. Out of shit. I'm gonna try freezing this guy. Actually, I can just go for the chest piece. Oh, that thing is an enemy again. Okay, I'm never fucking overlaying this shit again. Holy shit. A weapon that can brute force frost effects on them for the bonus damage. I think that would be the main one. Maybe like an ice sling or something that's fully upgraded with uh, all the coils on it. Or a hunter's bow, whichever. Because it helps impact damage. That goes really dangerous from close range. Oh my god, it's. Oh. oh my god. No, wrong one. Oh my god. See if I can freeze and pop with this bow. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's not happening, I think. I'd rather just shoot.
one though got stuck. Does he sometimes skip his animation before he jumps? Well, I'm just missing it, maybe. Not seeing it. I got blocked by something. Oh, the eyes are weak spots. I'm stuck. Oh no. Oh my god. No. Fuck it out. Okay, I'm out of heals. Look around, maybe. I'm this one. No, not this place. Oh my god, I need to move from this place. Make sure it doesn't attack from here. There. Should be okay, safe fine, enough really. now. We're coming down. Oh, I need show water arrows and these guys will die in like a minute each, I think. Oh man, I didn't know the slings were not gonna work on canisters. I thought as long as it was the same element, they just, you know, they just blow up. I think I just need like four different bolts of all the arrows to cover every single canister in the game. Snap. Okay, last one. Looks like a little puzzle piece. Let's see, what do I do here? That opens on the other side. Yeah, I don't think I can pull from underwater. Maybe different entrance. Non climbable branches. Oh, maybe from here. It's like a last point. Maybe you get out from there. That works. Now I just need to climb up to get to the top. Should be able to cross over to the survivors from there. It's 
surprised it was jumpable. There's a ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village, but debris blocked the passage we came in through. That ladder was our only way out, but we couldn't reach it from here. Don't worry. I'll find us another way out of here. Do you know what happened to the others? These people are so useless. The ladder was the only way out, so they'll sit there until they die instead. close how'd you do it okay you should have a way out thanks we'll head to the shore in a moment okay i think that's it for survivors i, can talk I should head back to matika Rest now. Aloy, thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Kentok? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Do you know where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the chief's guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakh are stubborn fighters, but Kentok? is more so than most. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. I can take another look. I Where's he said but the I'll save your whole fucking village. I'll do it. how she called the Tanak tenacious too like bro this lady was about to let her family die because uh, the ladder broke some of it to get inside. Time to head in. I don't have many heals right now. Let's see where this leads. That looks like a, a boss fight plate. 
All right. All right, dude. Take it easy. You must be Kentok. Oh. I was an outlander, not my name. The Teeker sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. And so, he made it. Good. And Natika. She came back? Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. <sighs> it was my mistake to deny her discharge. A soldier is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now. The waterfall must be coming from somewhere. I need to get higher up to figure out where it's coming from. won't work on that. Convenience. <laughs> oh my god, I wanted to glide, but I think a different bomb showed up, so it disabled my glide. I was supposed to climb from the side. section so much
waterfall I saw down below should be coming in from somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. This rope caster thing is so fucking clunky. It doesn't help that half the time you press it, the glide comes out instead. Water's coming in from there. I can use the fire to have to break open that wall. This should fall. You're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. Ain't no way. He would say that every time we sparred. Sometimes as an insult. Other times as a compliment. But I guess he was right. It was always my choice to stay or go. I'm sorry you didn't get to make amends. So am I. What will you do now? I'm not sure. Lady Mark has a chance. There's no way this tribe survives anything. And once that's done. I could join the chief's guard, but I have to lay him to rest first. For the full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades somehow draining <sighs> the <entire world>. <sighs> I'm ready to go back to sleep. <sighs> Thanks. And good luck. Whatever you decide. Thank you guys, a pin to the 91, Temple on Fangler 27, Code Fangler 29. Wanna hear a joke about a piece of paper? Never mind, it's terrible. Well, I don't have uh, a weapon for this. Is it this one? No, it was this one. You get a rope caster first. Was it going for an extra heal? No. I could go for the full stealth route. The um, grenade launcher doesn't get a tree, huh? Medicine? 
Did this one? Oh, it's here. Did this one then. Looks like shit and it's gonna eat my ammo. This looks okay. I'll go into this base. Fuck. Following the marker. This? Oh, uh, you're not waving a hammer around, Aaron. Try a gentler touch. And my big Sasha's fingers don't really do gentle, okay? Bring it back. Trace the line. To your right. Other right. I just saw it. It's the one Aloy found up north. Gotcha. They call it a, a concussion beat party or something. Yeah, now that's music. Aloy! Aaron, you're all better. And you're here. Well, he tells me that our savior needs our help after all. <laughs> and who am I to refuse? We still have much training to do, of course. One does not become hunter in a day. Each seed grows at a pace of its own. Doesn't mean it won't bloom. You should know your Tanakh friend arrived. Katalo. I heard their warriors drink people's blood. I want to sleep with one eye open. I think he's seen enough blood for a lifetime. I showed him to one of the rooms. He seems to appreciate the privacy. Uh, looks like you've got things under control. I should get this to Gaia. Right. We'll keep on training. Catch up as fast as we can. I'm seeing glyphs in my dreams already. Well, while you've been off gallivanting around, I've been working with Gaia to find out more about the land gods. So from where I'm standing, you're in need of some training. Come along. Uh... Oh, uh... Okay. I'm doing fucking for sure. Welcome back, Aloy. When you're ready, please merge Ether with me. Afterwards, I must discuss an important matter with you. So, what did you want to discuss? While you were away, I received an unusual transmission on my dedicated Aluthia frequency. Aluthia? That's one of the sub-functions you couldn't detect before. Yes. The transmission occurred so slowly that at first it seemed like an accidental blip of data amongst background static. Once I noticed this irregularity, it took some time to collate the complete message. Where does it lead? To a mountain to the northwest of this facility. A word of 
of caution, Aloy. It is possible this transmission is genuine. It is also possible it is being broadcast by someone or something else. You don't think it's actually Aluthia? I am uncertain. What's SOS? It is an old world code. A distress signal. A desperate plea for help. Why would Eleuthia send a coded transmission on a frequency only the two of you can communicate on? I believe it was done as a precaution to avoid detection, or at least to create the appearance of the desire to do so. I am also uncertain why Eleuthia would expect that I would be able to detect and respond to its distress signal at all. As far as it is aware, I no longer function. Okay, so... Either Aluthia is in trouble, and sent the message hoping we were out there. Or someone else is trying to get us to go to these coordinates, pretending to be Aluthia. That is my conclusion as well. Could the Zeniths be sending the transmission? According to the data I reviewed on your focus, the Zeniths recovered the other Gaia root kernel in the Hades Proving Lab. It is feasible they used it to gain access to my internal frequencies. So... Maybe they sent it thinking you'd respond, and reveal your location. Possibly. However, the transmission is highly irregular. If they intended to provoke me into revealing myself, I would expect the communication to be more routine. Right. So maybe it's not them, then. You said the coordinates lead to a mountain to the northwest. What's there? I have no record of anything of note in that vicinity. Okay, and what about the other number in the message? 237. Any idea what that means? I have queried my available databases, but it does not appear to have any significance. Perhaps its meaning can only be understood at the indicated coordinates. All right, I'll go to the coordinates and check out the source of the transmission. All by yourself? Ha! No way. I included Erend and Varl in this briefing via their focuses. I concur that you should not investigate this alone. What if it's a trap? Of course it could be a trap. But if it really is Eleuthia, then it's in trouble, and I need to bring it back. Don't worry. I'll be careful and... We're coming with you. Fine. Go grab your things. We'll wait for you at the west exit, in case you need to upgrade your gear. It's a pretty stupid trope, yeah. That she refuses help. <clears throat> but when you look at how the tribal people handle each other, it's kinda understandable. They are fucking morons, every single one of them. Maybe it's OP. Karja friend came through. New she shop? Went to that Osiron camp you two were looking for, to the southwest. Aloy, we've gathered some supplies in that chest. Take what you need. Useful. Can't talk to her. Far yeah. looks happy about his training partner. Learning is best done together. Have you gone back to plain song at all? I thought about it, but I wouldn't know what to tell them. The chorus already thinks me a thorn in the thicket. If they knew what we did to Fa, even if they understood, there'd be little they could grasp about all of this. No, for now I must leave the tribe behind. 
What are you up to? Gaia was kind enough to put together a list of glyphs used by the old ones. She helped me decipher some of the data you've collected and showed me how to use the focus to help the process. It's not easy, but it's been working so far. That's good to hear. Did Gaia tell you anything about Venus? She did, though it wasn't exactly easy to believe. To think that there are places among the stars where life can bloom as it does here, it is humbling, to say the least, and heartbreaking that such life should be bent on destroying ours. Sounds like you met my friend Talana. Yes, the Karja Huntress. I haven't seen armor like hers since the Red Raids, but Varl tells me that she too suffered at the hands of the Mad Sun King. Yeah. She's one of the good ones. Trust me. Trust me. Right. I should Is it maybe be careful. We will. Gaia doesn't need it. <laughs> there she is. You ready to head out? Let's go. Look at us. <clears throat> Three battle-hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. <laughs> uh, this distress call had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? Look at these characters, man. They're so fucking dumb. Well, that takes the keg. Burl, see if there's anything over there. On it. We'll check out the battlefield. Let's start with that zenith. How do they make such a cool sci-fi plot? And they add these characters written by like fucking five-year-olds. Almost didn't make it. Like a teenager, her army breaks. What the hell? And then fucking gets stabbed. Jesus, man. Whatever the rebels did, it took down her shield. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield too. What about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? What? It looked like she could Hello, make it come and go at will. What do you have for me? But it's gone. I now. checked everywhere. Still no sign yeah. of the asset. Well, go can do we your call thing. off this pointless search I'll wait already? Here. Let's not forget who let it slip away in the first place. Now, I'd like to see results by nightfall. Do you think you can manage that? Hold on. I think I see something. No, oh, that's it. Okay. Snow crunch. The Spectre had instructions to assist recovery of the asset. I wonder what this asset is. Holy shit. Laser weapons in a near impervious shield and she loses to 
caveman. <coughs> Fucking caveman. Ooga booga caveman with axes and spears. Osiram with a focus. Looks like he was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. Ah. Ah. Our weapon's still hot. I need to know how it worked. But I'll have to check on it once it's cooled off. Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? All right. I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to it. All right, she who sees the unseen. <laughs> what did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear, up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zeniths to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Osirum that was operating it was sending data on it somewhere else. It was probably just a prototype. I've known tinkers who do that. I'd do a little trial run before breaking out the real thing. Well, I guess it's still a work in progress, if it blew up. She was searching for something she lost. Her drone had instructions to recover something called the asset. The asset? Is that the uh, sub-function thing you said could be here? The Luthia? I'm not sure. Come on, let's go talk to Varl. I'll check out Stellar Blade of the game turns out to be good dudes. <coughs> this is just a demo for now or something? That's a long way down. Something tunnels. Does have nice ass. Looks recent. Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. That zenith the rebels killed was looking for something. I'm cold. not gonna bother with the demo. The asset. I don't know what it is, but my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Erend, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. I'm okay. not playing Ghost of Shima again. Any trouble no. shows up, I'll call you. Let's go. There's some kind of old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup of Gaia, right? Yeah, from the Proving Lab. So maybe they were after Eleuthia. Found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. Maybe. This was a far Zenith research lab. It looks like a lot of data was beamcast from here recently. From that device nearby. So Eleuthi is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. But then why were the Zeniths still searching for the asset? So, exploring another far Zenith ruin. At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer machines. Or anything you can blow up.
all this stuff. I just wonder what they were doing here. Find anything that might tell us what the asset is? I don't think so. <clears throat> I really hope the... The Zenith plot isn't stupid. I really hope so. This place they is need huge. such a compelling reason to Some actually kind of visit this planet at all, like ever. Maybe the asset is in here somewhere. If it is, somehow the Zenith couldn't find it. Oh, my potions Let's are cocked around. by something. Oh, two medium health potions. That's no, fine. Zenith seem really stupid, yeah. I really hate how they're written. You have these futuristic humans who are just... They're supposed to be smarter and better than, than everyone else. The control console. Well, and one guy Texas is a baboon who attacks with his fists and the other one just stands there dying. Well, let's find out. It's like they're not even trying to fight properly. That's a lot of supplies. <laughs> a lot of heals and uh, other random things. The billionaires? I think when you send out people like that, you're still sending out the best of the best, no? Like when we send out astronauts from planet Earth to, uh, you know, space anything, you're not sending out fucking uh, random people with no education, or whatever. It's like the most educated, the most fit, the most healthy, the most mentally stable people you could ever find on the planet that you send out. Like they're ridiculously over, uh, overqualified for it. And then they send these guys out, you know, they're fucking baboons. Let me check this side first before I move. Oh, is there anything? No. <laughs> what if these guys are the best? Oh no. Oh no, dude. What if they are the best? <laughs> 236 containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. Shit. 236? Wasn't there a number in the distress signal? <clears throat> oh god, which one is it? Oh, here, distress signal. 237. Beware! Alright. I should check the log. One of those hidden items if I select the random numbers. Why put like 666? It's Shaitan. <clears throat> Another clone of her? Or the one we saw before? Aloy. It's you. Skin's like ice. Must have cut this from her head. But why? Oh, she escaped, huh? Must have been. 
and then hit here. Hello, hello, Elizabeth. Uh, apologies, I don't know what else to call you. Um, my name is Beta. I'm afraid I, I must be brief. I only have a few minutes before my keepers discover I'm missing, and I still need to remove this implant. I had hoped to find shelter with you, but if you ruin this, I, I may be dead. Be careful when you take on Farsiness. They are ruthless, and they have Aluthia, Artemis, and Apollo now. But at least they don't have the Gaia Colonel to march them with. You must succeed. Oh, this was all for nothing. Good luck. And goodbye. So she's... She's still alive. We need to get her back to... Oh, shit. They can fly. Aloy. Aloy, can, can you hear me through this thing? What's going on, Aaron? Two of those spectral things just fell out of the sky. One of them is heading down towards you. The other one's waiting up here. We're coming up. Stay in cover until I get there. You got it. Get her to cover in that room. Whatever happens, she stays with us. I'll protect her. I should prepare before when do we get one of these in real life? I can't let it get through to Varl on the clone. When are we getting cryogenic stasis? So we can skip time for the next video game release. And only awake to play that and go back to sleep. Here it comes! Oh, what? I didn't think I was here already. Oh shit. Ooh, you ugly one, aren't you? Oh, oh, they're American, alright. Let's see. A highly advanced mobile combat drone. Gold play blah, blah, blah. Weapons can be torn off. Weapon on the top. Let's see. A. Energy storage. But it doesn't say what type. Maybe it's a special unique type. Looks like no matter what I'm doing, I'm peeling off armor first. Acid and plasma. Looks like I'm, I'm gonna shoot acid on this shit. Okay, well, nothing special on it. I think I'll blow up his weapons and... Voila, hope for the best. I'm dead. Okay. That's it seems to work pretty well. Now we start peeling again. Okay. Okay. I think it left something on the ground. It explode. Oh fuck. Another attack. Fuck it, makeup time. Where is it? That thing's quick. Oh, that's an attack. Oh, whoa, okay. It's long reach. Oh, you see that? It's a fucking nanobot. I thought it was just the armor. But it turns into like a billion nano machines and moves around. No shit. No, let go. I'm still in ulti shots. I spend those first before I apply elements again. Cool looking mob. Did it break? Can't tell. Okay, they shoot those fucking liberators. Oh, they're hidden until he shoots. No, he's reforming his weapons all the time. It didn't break. Up. 
Nano machine getting destroyed by bow and arrow. Maybe not. Am I dead? Oh my god. Oh god, holy America, Jesus Christ. One of the pieces is exposed now. Jesus, what was that? Does he have another attack after that? I'm not sure. for a big hit. Oh. I need to go check where the canisters were. I think it's about time I can find them. We're like under the front plates here. Oh, this one even drops a usable weapon, but it's hard to say what that is. It's on the top somewhere. Oh, it's that thing, I think. Uh, that's too hard to play going. I think the uh The crocodiles are more difficult than this. Oh, it's actually dead. Wow. Yeah, the crocodiles are way yeah. harder than these guys. Are you okay, Aloy? Yeah, I'm heading up top. Stay down here with the clone for now. Got it. I'll follow once the coast is clear. I guess Guzon's insane for the 10 months. Gotta get back up top and deal with that other specter. I just hope Aaron stays in cover. It's not because of the elemental attacks. I think this moveset is just much easier. And the hitboxes actually kind of work on this boss. Aloy. Ah. 
current. Yeah, the Spectre's dug its seals in. It's got me pinned down. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hurry. <clears throat> that doesn't sound good. I gotta get to Errand. Errand, I'm here. Watch out. That thing's shooting down the center. Stay put. I'll see what I can do. The second you need me, I'm there. It's not budging from that spot. I might be able to sneak up on it if I stay out of its line of fire. Fight if I take that thing head on. A heavy weapon. That could help. Where? I didn't even see it. This one? I was kind of worried I was going to hear me, but I guess it was fine. Welcome to America! Where did he come from? Green is corrosion Which is why this works on them It's dead? Dude, they're so weak. Seriously, I think almost the entire game's lost is weaker than these guys. Bruh, stop. Aloy, she's. Look, I swear I'm not drunk, but right now I'm seeing double. Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer. But we need to get her back to the base immediately. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for then? You two go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. If I can figure out how that thing works, maybe the Zenas won't be so invincible after all. Peel off anything? No, okay. I'm gonna knock off his weapon at some point and then try to take it. I haven't gotten it yet. It's died too fast, actually. I guess the idea is just you just shoot it whenever it pops up, huh? Fucking bitch. I 
Not the machine, son. Is Mongo blocking us? Probably just a ghost. I need to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zeniths. I should check on the clone too. Varl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control room. Okay. One sec, be back. It was a ghost. Welcome back. Aloy. <clears throat> I see we have a new guest. So now we know the origin of the transmission. Yeah. I also recovered this. The weapon it was part of somehow stripped a zenith of its shield. But it malfunctioned and blew up. If we can recreate the weapon and improve it, maybe we'll gain the upper hand on the Zenus. A moment. I will scan it. Futuristic anal bid. By combining the results with data from your <clears throat> I can infer that the weapon was highly advanced. Comparable to Zenith technology. But not how it worked. Did the explosion corrupt the data? It was only a catalyst. The moment the weapon malfunctioned, it appears a command executed to purge all data within its core. Ostensibly, this was to prevent the weapon's secrets from falling into enemy hands. Whoever designed this weapon knew how to cover their tracks. Silence. Based on your data on him, that is my conclusion as well. And he's not going to cooperate with us. Well, it was worth a shot. But that's not all. The Zenith got Aluthia, along with Artemis and Apollo. That is unfortunate. However, our original plan remains unchanged. The two remaining subordinate functions should increase my heuristic processing density enough to absorb Hephaestus. Right. One problem at a time. Well, I guess I better check on the clone. Before I head back out there. Yes. She <laughs> the clone. The maintenance corridor directly below us. Varl is with her. <clears throat> right. Thanks, Gaia. She's one too, yeah. I mean, she's exactly the same as her, probably. They're both cloned from, uh,. The scientist lady. That's fine. Hey, 
Aloy. Glad you made it back okay. She panicked after <clears throat> waking up and stumbled down here. I thought it best to wait for you. I'll talk to her. Hello? It's, uh, it's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of sensory freefall. Everything real feels unreal, distant. Is there anything that can help? Do you have a focus to spare? It's, it's primitive, but I can make it work. I like her a lot more. She speaks so fast. I wish Aloy spoke this fast. Booting up. So, Aloy, I suppose you want information about you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How did they get you? But let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago. That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a colony world after all. Yes, for a few hundred years, but it didn't last. Some sort of natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, so... The descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet. And now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants, it, it, it's them. The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. You didn't know? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What do they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you, does that mean that you're... I'm not like them. I was made on the way to Earth, on the ship. I spent years studying in my training interface so that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? What do the Zeniths want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zeniths want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. So the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Gaia and I concluded too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they... butchered the tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so... I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? Well, without their Gaia kernel, they'll have a hard time doing that. The Zeniths needed Elizabeth's gene print to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? They told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me. <clears throat> So I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. So you know about the extinction signal? It was speculation, but the only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. Gaia would have only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing function altogether. I should have realized that she would also order the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well... Surprise. So we're dealing with the same Far Zenith people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. 
The others, Eric, Tilda, Verbena, they resent his authority over them, but in the end, they always do what he says. Eric, he's the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah, I know. You mentioned the Zenith set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Off the coast, I think. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine force. It, it must be impregnable. What's inside the base? Launch facilities, so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus, infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Other survivors of the colony. You said the Zeniths colony in the Sirius system was destroyed. What happened? All I was ever told was that a natural disaster forced them to leave Sirius. I've speculated that it was an extrasolar object or a cataclysmic seismic event. Or maybe even an abnormally violent coronal mass ejection Corona. from Sirius A. The Zeniths never told you any details. They said the only thing that mattered was that they survived. First Earth, a thousand years ago, and then Sirius. Guess they survived old age too. I'm guessing they also dug out the entire planet, right? Took out all the resources. How did you it fucking collapsed a second time. Before the Hades Proving Lab, I never thought I'd get away from them. Even if I were to run, I'd never survive on my own in the wilds. But then I saw you. And I thought that maybe you could help me. So when the Zeniths pinpointed Aluthia's location in the biomedical research facility, I saw an opportunity. You said you saw an opportunity to escape when you went to capture Eleuthia. What did you do, exactly? Whenever I was taken out on a mission to recover a subordinate function, only one of the Zeniths would go with me. The one the rebels killed, outside the facility. Verbena's dead? How did they bypass her shield? I'm looking into it. But you were talking about your escape? Well, when it was time to use the Zenith's transmitter to send Eleuthia back to base, I also sent the encrypted transmission. Then I distracted Verbena long enough to seal myself in the ectogenic chamber, altering the facility's log so it appeared that there were only 236 containers. And the Gaia root kernel? I told them I could capture Luthia faster if I had it with me, and they believed me. <laughs> well done. Okay, okay, man. All right. You said you were born on the way to Earth. In an artificial womb, I'm guessing. The Zeniths had an. That's kind of believable. Aboard the ship. If they took just the richest people and nothing else. They must have used a stored sample of Elizabeth's DNA. <laughs> I doubt Elizabeth would have let them take her DNA. Do you know how they got it? That wasn't part of the archive I was allowed to access. You said you spent years studying in a training interface. Was this. Archive you mentioned part of that But only the parts I was permitted to access Aristotle and Aspasia the avatars of the archive Would assign me learning modules and evaluate my progress wait those names They were designed to be the virtual guides for the Apollo database Before Ted Farrow purged it the Zenith have a copy So it still exists got to learn from it only what was deemed pertinent to the mission if i requested information outside of my parameters my tutors would deny it to have all that knowledge just out of reach must have been frustrating all right i think that's enough for now do you want to come upstairs or so how long You know, your, your, your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenus? How did you know optimal strategy, so? Well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Gaius powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? 
You don't have Hephaestus already? Guy is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single- To a single location, of course not! You didn't even know who the Zeniths really are. You were supposed to be further along by now. Coming here was a mistake. They're gonna find me. They're gonna find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing. They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind. We're never going to beat them. Everything, everyone, they're gonna die. Hey, calm down. You're here now, right? So is there anything you can do to help? I have certain knowledge sets. And given your state of progress, expertise you probably lack. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Okay. Well, see if you can do Bitch something. Bitch is flexing. Else. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. <laughs> How'd it go? Her injury's not that bad, but I think she regrets coming here. Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. So I guess we won't be making use of Silent's weapon. And now there is another clone that is a bit here with us. But I can't let it distract me. Has that monster already showed itself? Still unknown sites. Hmm, <laughs> Thunder Jaw and Apex Slitherfang. Yes, yes. I still have two more sub functions to get. It's a little loud, Aaron. I know. It makes you want to punch something. More like someone. Or you're the one that helped me find it. People make mistakes. Aloy. Hey, thought I'd uh, check in on how you're doing. You mean after meeting someone who looks exactly like you, but isn't you, down in the basement? Guess this must be even stranger for you than it is for us, huh? A little. <laughs> Varl said she may be able to help us in our mission, though. Maybe. There is something I'd like to discuss. It's about the land gods. If you have time, that is. You said you wanted to talk about the land gods? I think there's a way to heal them so that they'll once again provide plain song with grain. Gaia gave me a set of instructions. She called it, uh... Reboot code. Turn them on and off. If we deliver it to the land gods, their derangement will end. That's great. Uh, maybe. <coughs> there are thorns on the path. Unless the code is given by Hephaestus, the land gods will reject it. Gaia showed me a way around this. We need components called control cores from machines made by Hephaestus. Machines similar to the land gods. You mean Grimhorns? Like the one we fought in the repair bay? Yes. Gaia helped me locate two of them out west. So, kill the machines? Get the control. Got it. We'll do it less. Got it. I need to get May the Level 25 quests. Oh. Aloy. There are more supplies in the chest. More free shit. Pizza? That's decent stuff. Oh, uh, but I guess nothing I can <coughs> really use now. I need to upgrade my weapon. I'm I'm not liking my damage output on the newer mobs. Oh, maybe I can get some new overrides here too. Rooms change. No, I'm missing stuff. Is that your doing, Gaia? Yes. I have repurposed the displays to track the cauldrons you have acquired data from. Yeah, this file's crazy. I didn't try to play shot thingy yet. I don't have a good sniper. Same to find one that I like.
Oh shit, how far is this? Oh, I have the campfire. This is where Zoe said we'd find the Grim Horns she needs parts from to heal Plainsong's land gods. I should let her know I'm here. Hey, Zoe. I'm near the Grimhorn site. Can you join me? I'll be there soon. Aloy, I'm glad we can do this together. The Grimhorns we're looking for should be just to the north. Let's go get those control cores. <clears throat> Thank you again for helping me. If this works, if we can heal the land gods, it will end a generation of suffering for my people. How do you think Fame and the chorus will take it? They seem to think the tribe's extinction is inevitable. I'll upgrade my weapon after this. Uh, there. I'd like to see be happy to be wrong on this. This mission. Oh no, not that guy. Apex game horn. This is a level 25 quest? Okay, that guy needs to die first no matter what. Oh my god, dude. What the fuck? Oh, there's another one. Okay, let's do as much damage as possible with the traps before the fight starts. Because this, this ain't happening normally. Oh shit, that starts the fight! Okay, one down. Wait, is it down? No, it's not down. Be smart about this. I'll follow your lead. Mm, that's a lot of traps. Go, go. We fucking lo holy shit, we lost.
for a big hit. Okay, I think one is almost dead. Oh my god, dude. Oh, oh my god. There's another one. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, dude. This guy has no more weak spots left. Is melee bad? Yeah, melee is terrible. So you can see my arrows doing like 50 to maybe 150 damage per shot and melee does uh, around 10 to 15 per hits. I don't want to listen <laughs> and cheese them but yeah it's a uh, it's a rough fight the ice attack one shots huh it's because of my armor ice minus 19 there's no poison in the fight I guess I'm supplying all his difficulty, yeah. Unfortunately. The problem with those, um, the mosquito looking ones is that they run out of weak spots before they die. And it's still a lot of HP. The Grimhorns. And they're not alone. We'll just have to be smart about this. Is that an range? God fucking damn it, man. Oh, I hit it. What? 
Fuck, can I shoot? What? Why didn't it shoot? Some weird damage animation when they get up. Get those control cores. Those guys have too much HP for how little weak spots they have. Oh, you're back. Should we the tankier Let's than the specters, us. man. One down, finally. I need you with me, Okay, better. Damn, I saw it too late. Oh my god, I didn't see that at all. Or hear it. I'm heading back to base, Aloy. Call me when you're ready to resume. I did not see or hear that one. Fuck. Usually that one's pretty good too on audio cues. 
There. The Grimhorns. And they're not alone. We'll just have to be smart about this. I'll follow your lead. Get those They're fucked up when they're synced up like that. Oh, you're back. Carry on with the grim horns. Let's get those control cores. It's these Where guys. Are you going? Oh, she's got it. She's got it. Let's get those control cores. It's exploding, right? Building. Jesus.
hate how much vision that level up pop-up skin blocks. Is that range? fighting <clears throat> it's no good gotta keep up the fight and build my stamina All right, just two left. Although these are fucked up. <laughs> Wait, maybe I can disable their fire attacks. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Blaze though, which is the fuckers on the top. It would be nice to have like a good sniper right now. Just do like one really big shot on their back. I'm back to upgrading weapons after this uh, quest. There's no way. It's unplayable with my cool and damage output. Oh, 
My old ride is not worth playing, no. Absolutely not. I'm completing it now for the sake of its. <coughs> you can see the other mobs, they just refuse to fucking die. Do they just ignore rocks or what? Oh, I see the cannons. Jesus. Yeah, oh, Jesus. Look at that fucker. A war machine. And what's the weakness? Corrosion. That could be good. I could use corrosion and then peel off the parts. Well, it's not moving, so... It actually corrodes pretty fast. Oh shit, I didn't see it. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit. One HP. Maybe I gotta heal. Oh, 12 heals. Holy shit. I don't think that was proper 1 HP. I think it was second life uh, 1 HP. Okay. I think they're kind of easy if they're alone. But they're not alone, so... They just cover so much fire on the one that isn't in front of me. Shooting with fireballs and drones and whatever else across the entire battlefield. I don't know if I can use the weapon at all. Can I? It's over there. Let's see. I mean, it's not exactly a fight where I can stand still and use it, you know? Moving won't save you. Just what I needed. Let's see. <laughs> Fucking bitch. Okay, all right. Okay, fuck fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Okay, I got this fire supply. Well, that's one of them. Oh, fuck. Aren't those real life weapons? What the fuck are they calling an air airbursts? Missiles or something? Oh my fucking god. These are dangerous. They barely block the projectile and I can't see if they're coming towards me or not. Oh, you're back. Should we carry on the grim here? Let's get those control cores. There's a long one. It's the other one that's low HP. 
This one sells both weapons. Where are you going? Honestly, I would pay money to watch a developer do a normal run through ultra hard mode. I would love to see their solutions to these kind of fights. Among Us? Wait, let's, let's get the other one. This, this one's one shot only. The other one is still four, I think. He wants it back. So that one has no range attacks left, I think. I, I hope. I broke up the fire part and I removed both guns. Never mind, it still has it. to the fire I think it goes for multiple HP bars before the fire is out oh there's a lot of heals here oh yeah, what the fuck did I press What the fuck? What is the calf button? Right click. Oh, it was right click. Zero heals left. That shit took eight heals? There's no way. Stop the horn? Oh, it is. Are you leaving? Oh, oh my god. Shit, the other one is shooting from there.
Jesus. No healing pots. Does this heal? No. There's no heals left. Okay, I don't think I have the damage output for this. What the fuck? How am I still holding this? Let's upgrade weapon. This ain't it. There's a hunting ground there. Ik heb geen programma gehad voor de plein. En kon van de sfeer voor die vrie. Is my mounted? No. I haven't found where to spend the hunting ground things. I need to explore. I need to go find the tall neck in the next few areas so I can get like all the material mobs out. updates today it's pretty crazy how many updates that game gets man wait i'm going to the wrong thing it's that one like these challenges uh, on the hunting guns let's see merchant here anything good no nothing all trash the sky clan welcomes you to our hunting grounds champion just i'm not liking how this arena looks already these grounds have been used to train our hunters for generations i'm sure they'll provide enough of a challenge Let's see, use false ammo and battle bags to build up the brittle state and destroy the cargo refining sacks. 
Shoot a battle back with force them to build a brittle. If you hit a burn, uh, explode the uh, range. When the battle black is in the middle, so you've lived in the sword's corner and gullets. I guess it's the two parts you're supposed to not kill sometimes for loot. Slide down any of the ropes and we can begin. Yeah, at least I have false saddles, so. Should be good. Wait, that's not even. No, wait, is it? No, it's not. It's that one. Oh, he lost his frozen status. I have to reapply after every single explosion, I guess. Does it have to be brittle, no? They all just give up? <laughs> um okay. Is there a stash here? Oh there is. I need to refill in hills. What is this? Couldn't have done that trial better myself. A reward worthy of your victory. Next. Locked requires a shredder gauntlet. I the fucking sold mine. Okay. I've trained with these trials myself. That's one damage of a blow. Oh, what? No, Let not a hop up is doing. Oh, it's over here. Hitting them with plants will build up the plants with the same damage time to the next because the damage will be for the same damage. Got it. Take your hunt. Okay, let's see. Hit the machine three times with a shredder. Catch up on the return you're in and charge it with fully charged to the machine with damage. That's it? You use the ropes to jump into the grounds. Then Seems more like a uh, tutorial than a challenge.
joke of a challenge compared to the fucking stealth one. The stealth one was insanely hard. The three boxes. Good to see you in an honorable prize. An honorable win. Next. Let's see. Uh, use plasma ammo on a roller back to build up, build it up to the plasma blade state, which which starts a timer. Inflict max damage to the machine to create the most powerful explosion when the timer ends. Additional damage can be inflicted by any. Oh, I see. But I thought that. I thought the previous tip said that you have to use more plasma damage to build up a bigger explosion. But here it seems like you can do any damage during the purple state and then he explodes afterwards. Well, okay, two minutes. Looks like I only have to do it once, huh? Slide down a rope no, two. To start the trial. Okay. This one might be hard if the plasma buildup is slow because of the uh, difficulty mode. I think it's just a build up too from uh, this description here. So I, I guess I get plasma on someone, and then after that, I just blast them with uh, no more arrows. These things are immune to plasma. What about this one? What the fuck am I looking at? Let's give it a scan! Oh boy. I'm not sure if that's a difficulty setting thing, but let's see. Maybe it has a weak spot for extra plasma. Oh my god, that's just it. I just have to apply plasma with that damage. Did not play this themselves? <laughs> it's never happening. It's barely a percentage per shot. And I can't dodge with this weapon, so that's like another thing uh, that will fuck me up in this fight. Pick another monster, there's no choice. It has to be that one. It's the lowest plasma build-up weapon. It is the only plasma build-up weapon I have, and the only one they sold here. You can only assume whatever they wanted the player to do was to buy the weapon here and do the challenge. What else? Especially looking at the difficulty from the first two challenges. I'm gonna need to upgrade a purple weapon, I think, from somewhere else. There's no fucking way this is happening. 
Okay, I need to find the mob that I have not seen yet. It was a... Older back. Isn't that a fucking older back right now? What the fuck were they called? It is. Maybe I can just loot one here. It's a pretty hard fighting spot though. Maybe I can burst it. Pick it up and get the fuck out. I don't have to kill it. I just need to break his tail and then run like a motherfucker. Shit, it's kiting. Shit, missed. Fight is fucked up. <laughs> well, I don't know where else this mob is, so... It's not really a fight. I'm, I'm just here for the tail, and that's it. Oh my god, my elbows went off. What the fuck? Shot the tail if I get proper hits in. Oh, it's attack from behind. Okay. What a fucking mob. Oh, I can't ult here. Maybe start from stealth. At least I get a freebie shot in. Done. I'll just pick up and get the fuck out. Okay, I need to kill one of them now. But not this one, I think. This this one looks fucked up, man. This whole zone is fucked up. Fifty percent do damage to close range. Ten hmm. percent overdraw bonus damage. Oh, if they show up here it must be a mob in the zone. Probably. I can probably look down here. What's this? Demeter. 
Oh, hey, there's a tall neck here. I didn't realize it was revealed already. I guess let's do that. I could keep a bit for the 86. Do, 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 do. That wasn't too bad. There's something insane about this game's range attacks on mobs. It's like at some point you don't even like fight the mob anymore. You're just, you're just dodging projectiles non-stop. How much you give this game out of 10? I'd say it's somewhere between five and a half and a six. It's like an uh, above average game. Where'd they go? Alright, how do I go up? Let's see. Stalkers? Two of them. Something above me?
Fuck. You amazed at how much damage I do? Oh no. If you're amazed how much damage I do? Oh no, dude, how little damage do you do? Oh no, man. so staggered I guess nothing left naked now I thought I heard another one. Okay. Your fights are a grind? Are you playing this in auto hard as well? Because if you are, I would really suggest you just like restart your game, dudes. Go on very hard. From what I've seen in the modifiers on very hard, it's very manageable. Since uh, elemental and teardown damage is 100% if you go one difficulty less. My mount attack. For some reason, was aiming me. I enjoy suffering. No, I actually enjoy this combat a lot. The things I don't like about this game is like the platforming parts and stuff. And some mobs are overly tanky, but not these guys. Like these guys are completely fine. For example. The decent challenge, you still have to put effort into the fight. Did I just get these get both of them? I could make like a really good sniper attack with this. Like this is some super sniper uh, coil. You have like three of these in the sniper. Shit's gonna ramp. Platforming plus me? I just hate bad platforming. I like platforming when the games are fun with it. And they actually put effort into uh, the gameplay of it. Oh, that's where the last one was. What the fuck? Oh, what is that even? Yeah, I'll go up. Let's see. What's that game I played with the 2D platforming? I forgot. It had all the fucked up jumps. Oh, it was actually Prince of Persia. Like when it's properly made for the game and it's satisfying to play, then I, I really like it. I like get super fun. But platforming in a game like this is just follow the fucking yellow paints. <laughs> This, I don't consider this platforming. <laughs> Did 
You just follow him and skip that path. And there's no other option at all. Heart Shatter Spike Flower. Let's see. It is... A new type of spear toss. Lots of kit on it. But I think it's not purple, so I don't play. What do you mean platforming? Platforming is like a whole genre. Basically, jump to one place to another. This game has those sections where you climb and grapple and jump from one place to another and I, I think they are dragging the game down like fucking crazy climb my way up to the platform okay what's left I don't think that's glidable there This or DD2? If you have to choose, I would say DD2 is a far superior choice. The thing is, if you haven't played this game before, just get the first game. And then get DD2. The, the, the first game of this is probably super cheap right now. And you can get like the full game plus the DLCs and everything in one purchase on PC. And if you've played that, and you like it, and you, and you want more of it, then you should get the second game. There's absolutely zero reason to start in the second game. They're the same game. There's no difference in them. Okay, fuck. I need to pay attention. Uh, why am I even walking? But yeah, if you like the first game, you want more, then of course you go for this. I think the first game goes on sale sometimes. It goes down to like fucking 5 euros or something. You can get it super cheap. Okay, I don't see anywhere to jump. Is this climbable or something? Maybe I aim for the ladder. The game looks amazing, yeah. I think graphically this is definitely one of the better looking ones. That's not what is happening. Maybe it's a different place. Oh, nice heels. <coughs> Must be a different place then. Mm. Look on more. Let's slowly look. Stop rushing. No way to glide, no way to climb. No yellow paint, ladder on that side. No way to go up from here. No climb avoids, no. Oh. Nothing here. Alright, I guess it's not here. Is there any other platform? Capo point there. What was it? On now. Oh, it's there in the back. Maybe I can just grapple there. Looks too high. Maybe if I jump from there. Is it reachable? No. 
Can you go all the way from there? From there? I think this is the platform to the giraffe, it's the other way around. Is it jumpable from there? No, there's no way. It's never clutch. Must be another way up or something for me. What the fuck? He's still alive. Oh my god, it's two of them. Oh my goodness, what the fuck? What the fuck? Why is my potion pouch for? Stamina potion. I think this is the last part where you jump over or something for the for the tall neck. the main path again it has to be something here it must be there's no way you go here and then you drop a ladder and it ends there has to be some stupidly obvious small ledge to grab somewhere Shoot that one. Let's see. No, it's not the shootable type. They shooting me. Use bird water and to my advantage. It's a new mob. Oh.
Oh my god, is that kind of level? No, I don't think so. Let's jump from that side, I think. <coughs> oh my god. What the fuck is that? It must be here somewhere. Oh my God. This might be high enough to jump on that tarmac. wasn't yellow enough but it's also so weird like how you can't climb some things like this you telling me she can't grab onto this ledge here so you have to do this instead and this is like right there It looks so jumpable, maybe from Slater Goss. Oh my 
the jump didn't go off. It's so weird because even the glide option showed up when I was pressing spacebar. I guess I tried to glide instead of jumping. I don't fucking know. There's no way I make this. It's doable. Fuck. It has to be doable. There's no way the only solution is to wait for the tall neck to walk by. Well, since I'm waiting anyway. Oh. Thanks for the ride, buddy. Now to find higher ground. <laughs> Thanks for the ride, buddy. I think the tonic was the correct answer, yeah. You're supposed to walk on his back there as he walked past. Better watch my step. Looks like I'm not alone. Look, I'm stressed from the game. You call this stressed? It's more disappointed than annoyed. I don't know what these mobs are. It takes so long for you before you can drop down even like that. Something really clunky about climbing in this game. Baboons or what? Where are these? You can't move. I could grapple in for a big hit. This must be the valuable point, right? It's gotta be. Oh, it broke. It'd really be a baboon. Okay, they're not that tanky at least. Where's the other ones? There are like three of them or something.
A ladder. <laughs> it's the cheapest shot I have. Oh fuck. Let's look around first. Oh my god. <coughs> and where do you lead? Probably in there, no? Oh wait, what? The fuck? How did it go in the hut? I didn't even see the yellow rope. I thought it was gonna be treasure. What if there's loot though? Alright. I should be able to find a spot to jump onto that tall neck from here. I'm gonna finish the game eventually, yeah. If I can rip that prime for the six, is an open door really a door? Or is it just a jar? I I should probably check the rest of this. Maybe there's loot. Oh, there's loot. I was thinking too. I'm playing on auto hard, and in auto hard, the prices of merchants is 5x. And even on 5x resources uh, spent, I have like uh, an insane abundance of resources. How fucking cheap are resources normally then? Like, is everything just completely free? It must be, right? It's only 5x in the first game, not the second? Pretty sure you're wrong. Price the same as hard as you have them? I'm checking right now, dude. <laughs> Difficulty modifiers. Uh, forbidden West. Wait, where's the better one? This one. Let's see. Double checking everything. Merchants wares are more expensive. Five times higher. Oh, this for difficult is the game setting on Grand Zero and Forbidden West. This one's zero dawn, forbidden west. <laughs> no, I think he's right. It's only the first game. I thought I had too many resources. Makes sense then. <coughs> no, he was gonna be alright. And now to get back up this fucking place! <coughs> oh my god, how did I go? Where was it?
These are the worst sections in the game. <laughs> you need to buy a you need robo parts in this game to buy items. Was it here? Oh yeah, it was here. Okay. Oh. <sighs> I don't have flight jets. I don't even know how flight would work in a game like this. We just nullify like all the tall necks. Maybe it's limited per zone. Oh shit, is this one even, is this good enough? go from here I just have to go there this Fuck was it? Is that size? <coughs> Blighted meat. I guess it didn't hold forward last time? What the fuck was the problem actually? Normally just all the gaps as you drop down. I fucking lost. I don't even know how the glider went off from the ground. from the ground
Oh, uh, where can I go? <laughs> Should I say? All the yellow mark sections are terrible in this game. I think without them, this game would be like an easy eight or so. They're just so slow. to make this and thought it was okay Fucking God. This fucking shit. Oh, I guess I didn't hold shift long enough. I don't fucking know. I need, a, I need a running start. Is it a climb up? I thought you're supposed to take them up like stairs. You couldn't climb on the other parts.
Oh, it's so slow. On the steps, which couldn't go up from the side. up guys No way, did I look at the wrong one? Did I look at the wrong one? It's not frustrating, it's just really boring. Oh wow, this one still didn't show up in that. Were oh, these adepts that talk shit about the Elden Ring? There's no way. I really doubt it. Fuck. This one didn't show those mobs. But they showed up here, so... It might be like one of these question marks, maybe. Try this quest, I guess. Maybe it shows up here. I really doubt they blamed what they were talking about. Eldering UI. The UI in this game is horrid. This game has that menu. You see that bottom left menu? The one where you go past 1500 fucking items when I'm on a keyboard. There's no fucking way, dudes. Yeah, it's the old Monster Hunter one. But even Monster Hunter has keyboard binds for PC. Yeah, like Souls games, it's the worst part of those games. It's terrible. They should just use alt bindings, like alt 1, alt 2, alt 3 or whatever for items. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Oh, hey, I randomly walked into it. Is he alone? No, it's two. Okay, let's see. I think I just fucking kill him. Ah, so that was on the ass. Ubisoft said, I don't know was bad. This guy said the quest was bad. What's the UX? Elder Ring quest, oh, god awful. Oh, that is some attack. That attack got me like twice already. Use experience? What's use experience? Because use experience can translate into pretty much anything in the whole game. Taking a look inside, see what I can find. In UI, this game's UI is absolutely horrendous. Like it's uh. <laughs> Not art wise, but functionality. Yeah, functionality. This game is fucking. It's fucking awful, dude. Like, for example, I don't understand why the stamina bar is on the bottom right. It's like such an important thing to know. It should be in the center of my screen. Same for my HP, by the way. My HP should really be in the middle so I can see what's up and when to use a potion. But all the important things are in the corners, away from the mob that I'm looking at. There's a stamina bar, dude. Bottom right! And it goes away too sometimes. And for some reason it shows XP when I'm fighting and everything. Like I need to know that shit. Shit, I missed. Like, there's a really common theme when- Oh my god. That's a fast and instantaneous kill attack. One thing you notice about every interface of a World of Warcraft player when they design it for themselves is that all the important info is in the middle of the screen because that's where you look the most. So HP, mana, debuffs, buffs, they're all in the fucking middle of your screen. Your cooldowns, all the important things. Here, everything important is away from me. I need to recognize the beginning of that ass attack. It's fucking one shot of it. Wait, this one's different. The fuck? Or is it? Does it have two different ones? Won't everything in the middle be cluttered? I mean, check that space. That space is an HP by the middle of the screen. Dead center, in fact. It was never cluttered, though. Oh yeah, this one's different from the other one. Okay. Okay, okay. No. Shit, I didn't even see the attack. Is the other one that good? No. Should be easy if I get a 1v1. Ah, oh, fuck, the cap is the one. 
Okay. All right. And I think that is that should probably be the global complaint of the entire game of every single player that played it. The fucking hitboxes. How do they make such gorgeous models and a world to play in? And then these hitboxes. Could use acid against it. Oh, no, it's the acid one. Okay, that's a very short warning for that attack. What the fuck? I'm not sure what to look for. I guess the tail goes up? And there's like fiery sparks. An old world ruin. Might be worth taking a look inside. See what I can find. <clears throat> I don't know if there's a sound cue. I'm trying to look out for it. It's a bit too fast. I'm gonna tag it to silly weak spots. There is melee in this game. I can show you my melee damage in a bit. Wait, let me get this arrow out first on this guy. Oh, he saw me through the lock. Oh, of course. Okay, he lights up and then it happens. <coughs> That is absurdly punishing for uh, position and, and the speed of that attack. Must be fire resistance, right? It has to be. No, not even. The fuck? Maybe I can survive with this. I don't know if I can iframe it. Who knows? Iframes are really wonky in this game. Some attacks are not iframeable at all. Oh my god. The melee attack. 36 damage. Let's fucking go. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Nearly a one shot of that. I didn't even see the projectile, but I think it was a shockwave from the ground. Where's it going? Oh, 
shit. I didn't scan it. Let's just not stand behind it. I think that's the way. I'm out of range for it from here. I'm, not, I'm actually not sure. Oh, oh my god, I didn't so see projectile. Fucking hell. Oh, okay, no. Scared of going close to him because that's the other one. If I aggro both, this fucking fight's gonna be a disaster. I can probably hit that though. Any weak spot left? Oh, there is. I think just don't stand behind them, huh? Let's kill the other one too, since I'm here anyway. Never know when I'm gonna get another chance of one of these guys being alone. No, they, on they only have one strong attack and that's the Giga Insta Kill super fast farts. This game has a lot of attacks that are just like super fast and insta kills. Mm. 
Usually insta kills are more telegraphed and slower. Fast attacks being lower damage. Yeah, this game doesn't give a fuck. If I don't have a mount, I guess I could, but the mount riding is really clunky in this. It's like driving a tank. I think this was the lightning one. Let me see. Oh no, it's another. Oh, I guess the random spawns. It's also an asset one. I think I got it. Did I? No, I didn't get it. Oh my god. Holy shit. I guess I'm all too early. How was that another hit? Okay, I think it's too hard to hit that part. Uh, let's poison him again. Oh! I don't want to stand behind him. Shit, I really have to scan it. I don't know what the hell is weak on this body. Everything looks the same.
this happens. Yeah, these guys only have one dangerous attack. My lucky day. Okay, next up is a Dreadwing Metal Fang. But I haven't seen a Dreadwing yet. I remember them from the first game. It's a big birds, no? Gloomy looking place. Guess I'll just go here and see what's up. Oh, was it the storm birds? Yeah, maybe you're right. I mean, that wing is new then. Is it the right way? Yeah. It's a marker being stupid. That wing at 25? I mean. As far as I can oh, tell, levels make almost no difference with damage. As long as you unlock the right skills. It's only getting one shot a nut from the HP pool. I need to up my damage, so this is the only way. Luckily, I haven't needed Thunder Jaws yet. I got the feeling it's all the way north. That thing sounds like something Thanks tucked God. away in the corner of the map. Thank you, Letter that for the 52. And all time, thank you, the 78. Thunderjaw. Okay. I don't know if I can get away with this, but I don't want to leave my mount. Fucking crazy aggro range, was that not? Okay, fuck, it's not here. Maybe it's like all the way back here then. Hmm. Move, bitch! What is this? 
Oh no, it's that place. Okay. Hmm. This tall neck is locked. Is there another tall neck? Could be all the way down here too, I guess. Okay, well, let's check here, I guess. Hope for the best. I think I'll find this bird and kill it and then play some uh, auto gladiators afterwards. I gotta farm my friends still. And I think I can play PoE in the downtime of gladiators. It's probably good enough. It's a convoy, no wonder. Oh shit! Why did you stop me, dumb animal? Go! <laughs> that is a lot of shit! Oh, I think that, that's some late game zone, maybe. So I can't get there. Okay, well, then... I don't know if I can go, like, left side here. Left side might also be, like, out of reach. Yeah, it doesn't even... I think it's blocked by, like, flying uh, mount, maybe. And if that's the case, maybe my upgrade is locked by... Story progression? Not sure. I can check around here, too. Small chance. Let's see. Let's go north here. No other weapons worth upgrading? Maybe. This place has gotten the best weapons I've seen so far. Mount cannot enter this location? What? It, it can't even back go backwards? What the fuck? I'm nowhere near done the main quest. I'm upgrading my weapons and stuff before I continue further because nothing is dying fast enough. Also, I remember getting really good coil. It was 10% bonus damage on something. Although, oh, oops. Oh, yeah, oh my god. Closer in damage, good chance, impact damage. He almost probably better even. No, don't tell me they're gonna cut my mount here too. This was a weird part of the game. It kinda made it sound like I wasn't supposed to go in here. And then it was fine anyway. Let me check the other weapons real quick. Let's see, workbench. I have no idea how far the story is in. No, how can I know? <laughs> Didn't finish it. Feels maybe like midway mark or so. Only fire arrow on this. That's it. But I don't think I care about that. Oh, 
I mean, the side quests are okay to do. I mean, they gave skill points, which is nice. Speaking of which, I have eight of them. But I've kind of run out of things I want to take it already. Like, most things I take now are just... They're just there. I haven't looked at all the Vado skills, though. When I look at most of these things, I just do flat damage. It just seems so bad. Hit strike and I guess get go hit. Well, one of these is weak spot damage. I don't think it compares to the one I have though. This one just seems insane. Syrup double damage. This one looks like dash. Well, they all look pretty bad, most of them. This one looks pretty good, I guess. Oh no. I don't know. The one I saw here just looks like the best one. For all damage, at least. And all damage that I need all the time. I haven't found a purple sniper yet. I think that could be huge. With the coils that give bonus damage on uh, targets that don't notice me yet. And then the perks too, from the skill tree, that give another 20 and 30% bonus damage here and there. I could probably do like a 3000 damage shot or something if I combine it with the ulti. Maybe one shot some of the bigger mobs, or like the medium sized mobs. Okay, let's check north. Oh, hey. Slitherfang. At least I found that one. I needed that for my armor, I think it was. Well. Water monster here. Sand monster here. It's gotta be here somewhere, right then? Flying monster maybe in the corner here or some shit? Wait, it detected me already. No rope there is, but I haven't found a good one yet. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck? 
I thought maybe it's uh, like a nighttime only mob or something. This boss design is really sick. I want to see if I can freeze this guy, maybe. It's never happening. <laughs> what the fuck is that elemental build? I can't even see the bar. Oh shit, he one shots. He does more damage than the, the boss wants. I didn't even see the start of the attack. Oh, what? It removes my fucking knowledge like that? Honor and strength. Is this my armor? No, not even. This one gives me lightning rest though. So maybe, maybe this makes a difference. This game has a lot of in-game backseat, yeah. I think they were really afraid of players not being uh, being able to complete their game. Oh, do I not have a socket on this? I thought I had damage reduction. No, I do. Hunting? What the fuck is he doing? How the fuck did that not hit me? Holy shit. weird okay that one shots too yeah, he's way higher damage than the the normal versions i don't think this one's happening it's 30 minutes of playing perfects and i get randomly one shots ain't no fucking way <clears throat> oh, I need to upgrade my armor though. But isn't he the one that drops the upgrades? The same as the first boss? I think so. But with like insane damage number spikes. I need more damage. I need more armor. I need more HP. The Apex variant seems really rough in general. It's just like all the stats on crack. Can 
Where's the villower? Oh no, it's not here. I didn't pick up any of these, huh? Oh, maybe here? I think these kind of spawns might just have like one specific spot and that's it. Make it so hard to find them. The side quest, I think. Here. No. Okay. What's even left? I guess it's not these that I've already shown. Oh, dude, don't spoil locations, man. <laughs> Like, why would you do that? If I wanted to know right away from someone else, I could have just Googled it myself in three seconds time. Don't be like that, man. You're not helping anyone. Too. I haven't found like a good weapon upgrade in a while too. It can be hard to Google something when knowing you avoid all the spoilers. No, really not. <laughs> you really think it's hard to Google the location of a monster in this game? Come on, man. What kind of fucking justification is that? My goodness. Some people. Whatever. Check the rest of the deserts. <clears throat> it happened to you? For looking a monster up? Well, the easy solution is to not Google anyway. Those guys have been asking me for help for the entire game.
I thought the tall necks were gonna show me all the spots. It's actually fairly limited. my sprinting when I unlock it to something. The performance in this game any good? Yeah, the performance in this game is perfect. Zero crashes, no FPS drops. It's pretty fucking good. Here either. Well, fuck it, I guess. I guess it's one of those things I just run into if I run into it. One last side quest then, or main quest, I mean. Poseidon's location. At least I'm pretty close to it. Guess I'll say over the 32. Is the combat system well balanced? No. It is absolutely not balanced. At the least not in this mode. I'm fairly certain that the devs haven't played this mode themselves. That's how unbalanced I think it is. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way, fuck. It's there. Wait, no, it's that one. Let's go of the rebels? We don't know. Whole zone here, Jesus. Search the wounds on the way on the ground. Okay. Better check it out. Someone's been through here. Wasn't much of a search, I guess. Oh, 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 I was at him. Oh, I was so close. Oh, 
to drowning. Maybe. Not, not to the embers. M Moreland, it's over. Well, not for me, it's not. Then you're going to die alone because we're not sticking around to fish out the corpse. We're through. So the visionary's fate hung in the balance. Would he choose life or succumb to deadly delusion? <clears throat> Hello. So, there's an ancient city under the sand, but it's flooded. Suddenly, a Nora spear maiden appeared. Yeah, okay. Um. Well, you're not typical Delvers. That's for sure. What's this? Uh, I, I call it a diving bubble. This is the Mark I. The Mark II was better, but uh, it got stuck halfway down. The air tube snagged. You went down in that. Yeah, I hardly expect a layperson to understand. Because that's pretty smart. Uh, I'm sorry. May I remind you, you got stuck inside and nearly drowned. It'd have to be portable, though. Machine kneecap, maybe? Well, you'd need a filter. Synthetic membrane would do it. With a hose to a compressed, compressed air, air capsule. Cap. Hammer and tongs. What is this? What is happening here? What? Get over here. She's a stranger. You got a name? Aloy. Moreland. Not a stranger anymore. You're a damn fool. Come on. I got the original schematics over here. Oh, um... <laughs> well, hold on. Just a couple of questions first. Fair enough. Partner? Partner? Oh, I don't like that... That title. No, Partner. I'd better get after those parts. There's a fully intact compressed air capsule in the Mark II, but like I said, it's stuck in the shaft. If you made it back up alive, I should be able to swim down that far. All right. As for the other parts, Stemmer scouted a herd due south of here that should have what we need. I'm on it. About the Dell. <sighs> Moreland, I'm not interested in salvage. Whatever you find below is yours. Great. I'll come back when you get the gear. Good hunting. Oh, pal is not worse than partner. Partner is especially bad because of Monster Hunter. There's one companion in that game that calls you partner for every single thing that she doesn't do. I thought we were finally going to get away from this place. Well, an elevator? Good thing that Aloy showed up. Built by Moreland, maybe. We'll see. The longer their sojourn in the desert, the crustier the shard counter's mood became. Well, this is as far as it goes. Why is that guy talking for a person? The compressed air capsule. Now to get all the. We'll find a way to get these numbers. It should be south of here. Optimism. This environment is crazy. Looks so good. over this area might have some useful data but how to get up there yeah, pretty spoiled again well this 
classes were more I don't understand how they put so much effort into these Let's kind of things work. and then some things fall so flat afterwards. I don't look for tracks. Like they make these absolute top tier monsters and animations. And then the hitbox will be like some absolute piece of shit. Like how the fuck does that happen? Oh, where am I going? Oh, it's just here. Is the world for empty? No, not at all. I think the world is good density. Oh, here it is. Yeah, the art department for this game is really good. Oh my god, I poisoned them. Next time. I hate birds. Oh, there's lizards and scorpions too. Looking for tracks. Not strictly in here. Okay, let me check carefully. Is that it? A grapple point, grapple point. There. Oh, there. Tracks should lead me to the heart. This must be where the herd left from. I better follow the tracks in the other direction. Don't see shit. Can stealth kill this? I'll net override. Weird.
Those are not my quests. I think that's a death ring, dude. <laughs> I wish. I'm uh, guessing the death ring is gonna be big. Huge mongers. Don't understand the purpose of the ammo mechanic? Same, actually. I also don't understand it. I think they should just have auto craft on it and be done, done with it. Let me set a condition. If arrows below 20, craft 10 more. Oh shit, it's two. Spend a lot on crafting ammo, do you? I don't think I've ever run out. Oh, it's not dead. I think the game is holding up well in the second half. It's alright. There is this obnoxious console thing though, where they put everything on hold down to do anything. You know, like hold down to craft, hold down to open menu, hold down to confirm menu. Kill the machine herd. Oh god, not the hold? Well, you know, holding down once is not bad, but when you're crafting arrow for the... 500th time it gets pretty bad same for when you fast travel and when you open the menu and when you open the door and when you open a box yeah the first hundred times aren't so bad but after you hold down the button a thousand times it gets pretty bad oh shit it's the kangaroos these guys are fucked up. Oh, I peeled it already. Jumping instead. What the fuck is that? Oh, those aren't even weak spots. Oh my god. This is highlighted randomly.
grapple in for a big hit. Synthetic membrane. Better check the other machines. Well, I might have a kneecap I can use. Wait. Would you crush your own left testicle for one million dollars? Oh, my my man, what? Huh? What uh, what am I reading here? I was chilling, shooting some robots, and I'm reading this shit? Why is it so expensive, though? Spots. Oh, let's see. Okay. drop it oh shit i think i killed one somewhere and i don't remember where it was one of these bastards maybe Pixel hunting in the desert. Looking for a single grain of sand somewhere. I'll check all the corpses again. This one? Oh, I figured this one. It's fine. The kneecap. Let's fucking go. I should have all the parts to build this thing now. Before I get back to Moreland. Okay.
Wonder why they made the choice to have the boat be so inaccurate. Seems like such an annoying choice for games. Got everything I need to build the uh the incredible diving mask. I think diving mask is enough. I won't quibble. The workbench is all yours. Like the full draw should just be hundred percent accurate. I can understand if like the quick draws and the medium draws are nuts. There's a marvel. But like the overdraw, man. It works. You'll let me try it. Definitely should be 100%. A very special salvage I want down there. Assuming I don't drown. So what are you really looking for down there? It's hard to explain. Something that caused a malfunction in the apparatus that controls the old city. I think it started the flood. Well, I, I thought we started the flood. Like we sprung a trap. I don't know how we were detected. But suddenly, the dancing lights around us changed. Lights? What do you mean? Images in the air, sparked by the embers, the salvage I'm after. Tiny hologram projectors? At first, there were lots of images. Women and I understand now. Food He's looking stuff. for old world porn. Holograms of naked women. They turned nautical. Waves. Fish. I understand. There was this flash of red. And the roar of water surging in. Wait, a flash of red? A, a red light. From a spot <laughs> near the grate on the floor where the water burst through. It was like a beacon. A warning. Thanks. That might help. I hope it does. And good luck down there. Okay. Time to see if this thing works. Probably get a, at least three dollars. Are you budgeting? I and you. It's. <laughs> I'm always. Oh, yo. New stuff. Oh, why does it have to be a bolt blaster? If this was a hunter or a warrior, it'd be perfect. It has triple elements on it. Long range artillery, though. Is that worth it? 18 build up on, on plasma and the other elements? It has to be worth it. It's gotta be. I'm doing it. I need a plasma shooter anyway. I have nothing for plasma besides that shitty one I bought earlier. Okay, I'm selling my old bow. You've been sold. This one can go. This is the old one. This is only 13 build up. The one's 18. But even at 13, I could not see the bar build up. <laughs> it just it just fucking stayed the same, man. Oh, I can make it over here too. Alright, I got it. No, this is whatever. Oh. Do us, leave us. It's probably super good. One upgrade already too? Look at that. Uh 5% damage upgrade. Oh, that's overdone on this thing somehow. Second upgrade, 10% damage upgrade. It's ramping. And then we're never seeing the next one, I think. This is it! My ultimate elemental weapon. Poor 
so good. I can actually breathe down here. I do need some currency for weapons. How much do I have? I have 200. It's good enough. Oh, hey. The breathing boy just went away entirely. The mask seems to be holding up. I've never been able to swim this deep before. Oh, it's my favorite section. On the water exploration platforming. It's everybody's favorite. Not the lore of this game. The lore of this game is really good. Like the the way this world came to be and why it is the way it is and all the things that live in it. Super neat. This looks like a building of my people. The funny thing is, it turns out the main villain of this game is billionaires from our time. And for some reason, somehow they've lived thousands and thousands of years or whatever. So think like Bill Gates and Elon Musk. The villains of this game. Holy! Is that a Tide Ripper? Yeah. And the story explanation for them coming back here was because their own planet they they um, took the colony ship to it went to shit through some natural disasters but it was uh, only proclaimed by the billionaires themselves my guess is they also exploited that planet to shit and came back here Take a card on Wyvler 39. Oh, I can go for here. Seems like no. Or is he doing it? District. Wait, that thing is. Oh my god, it's aggressive! Automatic drainage controls offline. To execute an emergency purge, manual reset of primary and secondary pump nodes is required. The purge can then be triggered at the pump maintenance station. If I do this purge, I get a pump. I can fight that big machine on dry ground. Looks like I have to reset a couple of pump nodes first. According to the map, there should be an access point for the first node south of here. I don't even know why I look at the map like it needs to be looked at. I just need to follow the marker. <laughs> More machines down here. Come on, swim around them. Stick to cover. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, not those fuckers, man. Oh my god. Hardest mob in the game. The objective track is good in this game? It depends on what you mean with good. I suppose by design it's very good. For its purpose. I think they take away a lot from the game too. But only if the environments are hard to navigate. I actually don't mind following markers in most games. It would be nice if they remove them for places where you can just explore freely and there's actually things worth exploring too. And you don't get punished for going somewhere. You know, you go you go explore something really far in and it goes like, oh, you need double jump. Now go back. Where do I go up? In the yellow paint? Brown paint? No.
fuck, I didn't see what the Elo said. Oh, I see. This game reminds you of God of War Ragnarok. There is uh, like a really big overlap in design from a lot of PlayStation games. Even from like The Last of Us, Ragnar uh, God of War, Horizon Zero Dawn, the Uncharted games, the Tomb Raider games. They all have like this exact same design when it comes to these random puzzles where you navigate with climbing and pushing a box and pulling a box. It literally feels like one guy making it. And I think it's a plague on the video game uh, industry as a whole. It's such bad content for games. Better swim back up and find the access point for the second node. I'm getting fucking one guide, man. And now surprisingly in Ubisoft on Prince of Persia <laughs> it actually switched up. That one had really cool ones. Super cool puzzles and platforming sections. Oh, 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 is this tall grass or what? I hope it counts. Oh, I think I throw behind it. Fuck it. I, I never played the old Prince of Persia games. The new one felt so nice to play. Like the whole... The whole game just felt nice overall. Oh, oh shit. Oh, fuck. It's not echoed yet. Nothing beats the golem puzzles. I don't even remember the golem puzzles. That game had puzzles? I'm playing with mouse and keyboard in this. Mouse and keyboard is mostly fine. There's, there's some like overlapping keybinds that are super annoying, but it's only at certain sections where it gets in the way. It doesn't get in the way in combat for the most of it, so I think it's passable. Oh yeah, the fat guy hitting the boards. I guess that was a puzzle, kinda. It's awful though. Scary. I skipped the yellow paint to get here. Super scary stuff in games like this. Thank you, do not disturb for the four. Maybe that debris is weighing it down. Okay, let's see if that helped. Despite all the hate, Golem will see if you enjoyed watching me play it. That's because you weren't the one playing it, you fuck. This fucking guy. This fucking guy. Okay, fuck. Uh, I don't remember if you said this counts as tall grass or not. I think, she, I think it did. Okay, fuck. I'm testing right now. Where am I even going? Yeah, that side. Where is it? Oh, oh, fucking hell, it's right there. I'm looking forward to shit game week. What game is gonna be this year? There's a lot of shit games in the world. How good are the graphics in this? I think this is one of the best looking games out there ever made. The console I found earlier. 
It's up there, man. That might be the maintenance station. But how to get in? All right, how are we pumping? Elden Ring? Elden Ring is not that good looking. Elden Ring is king of gameplay. But uh, in terms of looks, it has good aesthetics. But graphically, it's not like super impressive. It might as well be an early PS5 game or a PS4 or like a late PS4 game. Okay, let's see where this leads. Can I open this? Oh, okay. I think I'm in the maintenance station now. I just gotta find the console to activate the emergency purge. Hacking? Hacking. Anyway, graphics are secondary for me. I'm always a gameplay over graphics kind of guy. And there will not be a single instance where graphics will ever be more important. Except for pixel- fuck pixel games, dudes. There's too many crappy ones. Speaking of graphic games... News and trending on Steam yesterday was like fucking four porno games. Like four or five. Jesus Christ, dude. The names of those games are so ridiculous, too. Like fucking orgasm simulator free or some shit or porno island. I think there's one called living with your stepsister or something. Like what the fuck? This looks promising. <laughs> there should be a console in here. How's that? My store page is news and trending, dude. News and trending is what's <laughs> being sold right now there. and gets the most views. <coughs> I didn't play Minecraft much. I just never gonna go into it. There's a limit for graphics. That one's too ugly. So we fucking this lapras or what? <laughs> okay. I can deal with that machine guarding the door on the other end of the dome. And once I get past it. Oh my god, I thought I was dead. I couldn't glide. Yeah, remember that hair short hair like two years ago or shorter? Oh yeah, dude. The thing with hair is that it grows. So like every single day that passes, or even seconds probably. Like, hair goes a little bit longer. Every second that passes, a little bit longer and longer and longer. For most people. Some people are... follically challenged. And they will not go here. This is such a cool zone. Holy America! Wait, is that even the White House? I can't tell. What the fuck? Oh shit, that's all on my right. 
shit I missed. Sit the fuck down. Oh, that's so hit me. This is one of the cooler maps in the whole game. Okay, to finish off that one fucker, this one. Fuck, I missed! Got him. Okay, kill the little small one first. Wait, I have chill water damage now. Somewhere. Don't I? Oh, right. It's a fucking launcher. It's not an arrow, so it doesn't work. stuff we could try it and freezing him is quite advantageous it's a long-range weapon though and i'm not liking my odds against him long range yeah okay man okay that build up is completely worthless Yeah, I don't know why I even bothered. Why did I ever bother with this weapon? Impact damage is the only way to play. You love elemental status force in this game, just need a weapon of high build up? That's if you play on non hardest difficulty, because on hardest difficulty, they half the elemental build up. So, half the weapons in the game. Let's say half. Almost every single elemental weapon in the game becomes non viable. Them. Deal with a big one first. Oh shit. Oh my god. Jesus. Wouldn't be surprised if that guy's fossil resistant too. Damn, I hit the cap. So for some time. I could grapple in for a big hit.
Fire electricity. I have electricity too. Oh my god. What the fuck is he doing? He's weak to this. Actually, it's pretty good. Oh, I can see this being really good if I get like a few more upgrades. Such a shit weapon though. For dodging. Oh shit, I kept 60 at a go. I need to use everything before I switch it out. Oh my god. What the, what the fuck is this? Why is it so buggy? I'm just tapping R one time. What the fuck you teleported? The fuck? really high damage to all naked armor parts on top of being elemental it's a good weapon what the hell it's actually good I'm just gonna peel some armor plates off it, I think. I could do like triple lightning trap and then hold position and shoot them as they come towards me. That would work, I think, if it's 1v1. It's upgraded one time right now. Plus, um... I can do like triple elemental build up extra on it too. <laughs> and then it's another 30% better. Is that all the loot? I mean, even if you have coils and, and everything for that man, it doesn't matter on this mode. Because at some point, if you try to brute force an elemental reaction, you might as well have shot him normally with arrows. He would have died like in all the time. And so you don't go for melee? The melee I don't go for is because enemies one-shot you. <laughs> and you don't get iframes for doing the melee executions. The so most of them are not viable in this. Where did that machine go? Aloy! It's a miracle! Oh, this was supposed to be the first time you meet this monster, huh? I farmed these guys like three times with the bow upgrades. Was this you? Did you lower the waters? Yeah, but there's a new problem. That thing's in our way. Wow. Yeah, it's gonna be difficult to keep the embers with that around. There's the scrappy band of adventurers. What is with this guy? Why is his narrator? They knew what they had. Are you crazy? Hush now. She saved our Delph. Okay. It's Lepros, yeah. I'm gonna fuck it. Stay up here and start firing when I engage. 
It had the plasma nodes, right? Those I couldn't get to before. Missing the lightning fingers? Or... I think he's missing the lightning fingers from the other one. The one that I used the chain stun with. Don't think it's the ones in the back there. Yeah, it doesn't have them. Well, actually... I don't know what cancer that is, but it's something. Chill water, use a frost arrow. Oh no, it does have them. I don't see them though. Fuck, which one is it? Oh my god. The fucking highlight messed me up. Oh, they're untargeted. Shit, it doesn't go away. It's one of these. But I can't tell the color anymore. I think it's that one. It's hidden behind like a thingy. Oh Jesus. I'm not super good on heals right now. Saying it. it doesn't have the plasma thing yet, I know this. How many heals left? Two heals left. Okay, doable. Playing safe now. What the fuck is that? Dude.
Jesus. Four heals, okay. Oh, what? I didn't see what hit me. That gets me often. Shit. Okay, fuck him. Oh my god. Two shots missed already. Was that a miss though? Holy okay, Fuck I, I missed my whole ulti, holy shit Oh, that's the one shot wave. But oh, it didn't one shot. <laughs> it's also a lot harder than the one on the. In the wilds. 
It doesn't have those very abusable four lightning canisters that you can just explode back to back. This is like the one shitty free freezing one in the back. Oh my gosh. And this arena is a lot smaller. Oh god, I'm out of fuse already. Is he Apex? No, he's normal. Okay, I'm just killing the sacks and stuff. Fuck it. Fuck the extra loot. I guess it is a super weak version of the other one. On, on. Ah, fuck the coup. NPCs were shooting, were they? I thought they were just watching. Like always. I got hack and love puns for the so subgifts. I think compared to the other uh, Nessie, th that was like 30% of the HP or something. I was ready to fight for another 20 minutes. Okay. Poseidon should be hiding in some kind of processor. I need to find a console to gain access to it. There. I should be able to use that console. Oh, that was pretty easy. I expected this section to be longer. And triggered a restart of the city's power system. Wand and crew must have headed back up top. All the embers they could carry, I bet. Okay, I'm gonna um, go to save and. Play some other gladiators and lose streak on my first hero because I gotta walk my dog. I'm gonna lose streak the shit out of it and probably still win. Here I come. Jesus Christ if I got stuck there. Building of my people. Am I going the wrong way? Oh no. No way. 
I think I saw a grapple points. Yeah. <laughs> I barely saw that. And I also don't think that was the intended way of going up. I spend more time on Rise and Dragon's Dogma. I think it's a matter of content, is it not? Dragon's Dogma is uh much shorter. I don't think hours played is an indicator for uh like enjoyment or game quality though. Some games simply have more time when they just waste your time. And more things that waste your time. Like this game has a lot of dialogue that I really don't care about. Whatever I did, it must have powered up the whole. legacy ensured our hero beheld the sea of desert lights and wept at his good fortune when i saw the embers as a child i never dreamed they could be like this thank you aloy well, did you find what you were looking for i did and now i have to move on oh oh Come back when you can. I got big plans for this place. I thought you wanted to put on shows with the Emperors back in the claim. Oh, no. This is the show. Oh, can you imagine? Folks from all over the land coming to take it all in. Plus, some food and a nice place to stay. Not to mention a variety of entertainment venues. Uh, don't forget, games of chance. Plenty of shards to be had there for certain. <laughs> A new dream, huh? I am. Um, I hope you make it happen. Goodbye, gentlemen. This delve is a story for the ages. All thanks to you. Morland and crew is gonna stay. Maybe I should come back and check on them later. For now, I need to get Poseidon back to Gaia. But I might want to find that Osram camp first. See, Let's see if that one showed up yet. No, right? Dreadwing meant to hang on, though. Mm. Okay. Delana made it. Dun 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 dun. Okay, um, let me just start the game, I guess. <laughs> I'm just gonna lose three kit, it's fine. I will come back strong! Tubi is playing it now by himself? Leather matches? Oh, dude, I'm not playing ranked when I'm lose taking like that, okay. I'll do it after. The fuck is ranked anyway? <laughs> oh fuck.
Come on, let me go AFK. <sighs> this infinite loop. Okay, I'm gonna BRB and walk my dog. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one.
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. My first place or what? Oh, I fucking lost. Eh, let's lose one more round. Oh shit, let's take this. Thank <laughs> you, Guns and Rockets for the night. Whew, okay, okay, okay. What the what item did you get? Ooh, corrosion, not bad. Mm. Oh, these are not bad. <laughs> okay, 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 good enough. Oh, I got a gift box too, nice. Did I win a round? No, I'm 0-5. Unluck. Jesus, 6 damage? Guess I'm going... Good than something else. Take this for level. Make atmosphere for the 67. Which custom games are better? Oh, they put a timer now on the item choice. Wait one sec.
Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. I think Walker 3 had the uh, best custom maps of the time. <laughs> there was so much creativity in those games that they spawned entire genres in, in then the future, which is now. Period after this? I think I'll play period doing this. <laughs> I could probably do it. Warcraft 3 spawned so many games, dude. So many concepts for games and genres and all sorts of mini games and, you know. It truly really was a gold mine of ideas and then people just took it for granted. Blizzard took it for granted. They were like, uh, who are these fucking losers, you know? Making their own maps or whatever bullshit. Wasn't there a time they tried to monetize them? Or am I misremembering this? I think it was Starcraft 2. Oh, was it in the remake? Yeah, okay. I just remember there was backlash for it. People were like, rah, 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 rah. it was free then, it should be free now. I am not taking more wards. <laughs> this is all the ward I'm getting. Oh, hey, they buffed this. It used to be three fury stacks per second. Now it's six. Why do, do I know the numbers of these fucking things? Am I... Am I a fucking nerd? Jesus. Oh, they buffed the ward select? Oh, you're right. There's some kind of activation thing in there. Oh, I guess it's the debuffs they put on enemies. And boy, on allies too, huh? Like shield. Thank you, Jensen, for the 150 months of tier 2. Hope I'm having fun. I'm always having fun playing this game. I mean, it's one of those games, you know? The one more, one more round kind of games. I don't have glasses, dude. I, I would do it. I need like one of those fake frameless glasses just so I can adjust them whenever I say something that might sound smart even if it isn't. Oh, they bought this one too. Come on, refresh. Hundred furry before the fight starts. It's a lot of furries. Nah, fuck it. Ten, a lot of people nine, holding crit. Eight, I might not seven, get what I want. Six, five, four, three, two, one. This guy DC too. <clears throat> oh, this guy's full in four kit. One guy's going kit. One fucking guy, man. It's always one guy.
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, he's the kid guy. I think I'm stronger. I think he's a weak ass bitch. And he should get away from my board. <laughs> Why are you barking? <laughs> Why are you barking? <laughs> For sure, man. For sure. Ugh. Like I could play POE in this downtime here, for example. This like no one ever fucking raids up in this game, you know, so Damn, is that too small? I don't know. They buffed us by a lot. They nerfed body of sturdiness. Ten, Men. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, it's kind of weird the game one. is in the bottom right corner. Fuck, I want to watch the fight though. Ah shit, man. Ah shit. Ah shit. Whatever, I don't need to see enemy HP. Actually, I want to buy more skills. What the fuck? I lost? My knowledge is your knowledge. Our knowledge. These are not the greatest rolls. It's too small, you can't see? Ah, dude, if you can't see, you can open your eyes, man. <laughs> yeah. You gotta open your eyes right now. Fuck, I don't have an orb of chance? How do I, how do I afford the orb of chance? Talakota. You get him, boy. Fuck is this window for ants? I can't see anything. <laughs> ah, shit. What build am I going for? I'm going spell totem, I think. I, I don't know. I haven't really decided fully. I, I might switch to like mana stacking just because it looks really cool. But I also kind of want to be like a hipster and not follow what other people are doing. So I'm contemplating still. Don't do anything I would. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. 
I think Ballista told him it's not happening because I just don't have the... Does he not sell Orb of Chance here? I don't have the Dex. Wait, what the fuck? I'm getting shrekt. This is a fucking everything build tinker. I might not go Ballista. I uh, I might go for a Spell Totem instead. Seven, six, Do I have a Orb of Chance three, in here? Two, one. No fucking Orb of Chances, man. Don't any of these NPCs trade it? What is it, Exile? What the fuck is this? I'm watching you. Yes. Oh. Six. Let's fucking go. The shield is too hard. I heard from a friend that Divine Ire is really nice on spell totems. So either it's good or I'm removing him from my friend list. Alright. I believe I have lost the fucking game. I need to spend soon, huh? It's not happening like this. I don't think there's uh, legendaries left. They're all taken already. Okay, this is this is way too small, man. My 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 fucking eyes cannot cannot see it. Holy shit! Was it a giant laser beam? It's kind of slow in damage, you know? It's time to spend! Molex died. Insta disconnect from the gate? What the fuck? I'm still in here. Oh, oi! Oi! Disruptive furries. Ten, nine, they always are, aren't they? What? Ah, actually, I'm not staying for this. Well, I have one legendary. Me thinks I fucking lost. And it was not even close. Is he done already? <laughs> one game? Holy shit. Hey, what the fuck? Is 
I don't know. This spell's kind of slow. It's a really slow charge up. I feel like all the totem spells are kind of slow. My game crash? What the fuck? <laughs> no, game just disappeared. Oh wait, maybe if I connect the coordinator. No, Pure is still there. Fuck is this new patch? Oh, I'm still in it. I guess <laughs> I guess I'm loose streaking again. Uh, that's what it is. What am I playing? Crop of Pain. I won every round so far. Feels good, man. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, what the fuck? Mr. Cloud is still alive? Feels good, man. <laughs> One. Does this totem actually speed up properly if I get enough cast speed? Like, let's say I get like 200% cast speed or something. This is just insta attack. Cause this ain't it. This is some shit. The best level. What the, what the fuck? I looked away for like one second. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I could set up for this totem. I'm set up for like fire damage right now. I think I win this. My poison damage ramps harder than his rage for whatever he has. Probably. Probably? No? Yes? 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 Let's fucking go.
Whoa, they buffed this so much. What? How does it even balance now? Okay, let me set this up properly. It's already <laughs> everything I can do right now. Oh, I need to change my skill ball, I guess. But I have no refund points. Uh, I guess I gotta get away from... I don't know where even. There's lightning damage here. See, I'll never get there properly. Power charges, energy shields. Oh, there's lightning right here. Oh, dude. I'm just gonna refund these two here. I'm still got my mage build. I mean, all the character, yeah, and it's still there, of course. Mage build doesn't go away. <laughs> I don't want to be a frost quap, man. The game is uh, making me play frost quap. Just storm burst. Ah, isn't that like a mind skill? I don't like the mind skills. I can't play both games at once. My build is too shit. Horizon fonts? I think Horizon is uh, like a slightly above average game. And that's about it. It's very good looking though. Thank you, Mr. Claritas, for the 86. Nine. Eric Sacha, thank you for the free. The Leran, thank you for the 123 months of the free. Five. Rob the Glob, thank you for the 62. Benji Tonks, thank you for the 22. I make a new character for Elden Ring DLC. I'm gonna go through the entire game once again.
Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Steve join later? I don't know. <laughs> it's gonna help to him ask him. Oh, I'm losing this fight. Holy shit, he's strong. Looks like they have a nerf next, huh? So it looks really overtuned. Oh, they didn't nerf him. I'll try Hollow X break, yeah. Hmm. 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 That guy spent gold and lost. Dangerous combo for him. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. How did he lose to the creep? How? Full spend and he lost to the creep and he wins against me. How the fuck does that make sense? Ten, 
Come on, give me the weakest fuck in the lobby. Ah, shit. No, wait, this one might be fine. The poison might ramp up. It's probably fine. Like now? Shadows like every second. Just shoot it in his fucking mouth. It's fine. It's fine. It's fucking fine. Easy. Free fights. Shit game. Fucking dog shit game. Gosh, how's he so strong? What what is this? 36 points in regen. What the fuck? What is this? Maintains one helm for one time upon being eliminated and gain 900 gold. <laughs> the fuck? Nah, I'm good, bro. <clears throat> okay. That's all in poison right now. I I could use one more level up to unbody. Okay. What exactly does this build do? It doesn't tank, it has no damage. It doesn't even regen that much. It's a frost reant, isn't it? No, regen and health. He just survives until he doesn't. Okay, let's get fast to level 20. Actually, these are a bit too good, man. Fuck. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, <clears throat> 1. I think these fights are free. Cause he wants a long fight, right? I think my long fight is better than his. I think my fi long fight is way better than his. Fucking dog shit game. Ah, we lost. GG ends. It's over. It's over. Yeah. GG. The fights are so long in his lobby. There's no uh, crit and there's no ulti. <coughs> Wait, I thought it was Furious X. Oh, it's both. I guess I'm going furry now. Ten, nine, eight, oh, dude. Okay, seven, it's too good. Six, five, Fuck. Four, three, two, one. I can go one point poison. I'm playing solo, yeah. I might have friends for next game. I'm sure Steve wants to play. Oh, you, oh, you went for another ranked game? Really? What the fuck? He's been playing all day, hasn't he? Okay. 
I don't think I'm playing PvE today. I'm playing a bit tomorrow or so. Or maybe after I finish Horizon. Then I'll do like PvE in the morning and then... Oh, the rest in the evening. All the gladiators. I'll see. Yo. Okay, finally. Yo. Well, hello there. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Finally, some luck. And I cannot beat this guy. <sniffs> Fuck. I wonder he has a legendary too. Isn't he? No, he doesn't. It doesn't matter because he's over two fucking things, assassin. Actually. Oh god, I was close. Holy shit, I was close. He's giga strong without any legendary shit. Fucking hell, eight damage for that? Jesus. He's rich too. Rich is in the lobby. Please let me kill this guy. He looks weak. He's weak. I don't know if the silence talent is better. I'm not sure if I'm getting my ulti off in these fights. Especially against the Knicks. I think the silence stand is much better if you have initiative. If you have initiative and arcane um, thingy where you get mana back, you, you could probably chain silence the guy forever. Oh boy. This guy powered up since we last fought. And I'm still stronger. What damage is that even? Warp of Frost. His item did the most damage. A random fucking item that he got. Wow. That is some shit. Yeah, this ult is never coming off. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 
one. I bled. Holy fuck, it's chanceless. Oh my god, he's still getting first place here. I'm dying in two more rounds of him. There's nothing that can save me in this. Maybe like body ulti, but it's already too late for body. I'm not even sure if I beat the other ones. I beat the life stealer and I beat one one other at least. Oh what? I don't ever remember fighting this guy. Fuck men! Fuck men! Fuck man. Seven, six, five, four, <coughs> I don't think any of this helps. One. Well, I have two more legendaries. Okay, this guy gets Oh yeah, he's dead. Oh my god. I need the poison legendary, but I'm not even sure if that does anything against the Nyx assassin. Like he he just kills me. No cares in the world. Shit, I'm dead. Shit, ah, shit. Shit, shit, shit. I can win. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Get through it to 40 and uh, pray to Allah and hope for the best. No, I can't get 40 fury here. I don't think I can beat the Kunkka. Yeah, I think the Kunkka just kills me straight up. I sneezed and I lost. Feels good, man. See if we have any gamers. <laughs> then I simply queue. <clears throat> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> G 
Jane abandoned hopeless. Paid to win. I can buy a new hero soon. Oh, there's no new hero this patch, huh? Where is there? Feels like the list bumped up by one, but I guess not. Isn't this new? A season passport. Shit, for real? My passport? We lost. No, wait. Wait. If he doesn't get any multicast, I win. I think if he gets even one multicast, I lose. Okay, he was allowed to have one. Win! I missed the last two hits. What? Shit, there's nothing good to play to take here. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, I'm simply tanking my losses. Five, Ten percent evasion, two misses in a row. Oh yeah, yo, yeah, yeah, it's real life. Another RNG fight. Actually, I think I cannot win this. No matter what. Even if he barely pucks, I lose. He did not puck once and I'm losing. It's not even close. How we lost? GG call it. GG end game call it. It's over. Fuck it now. Nothing good. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Fuck it now. One. Oh shit. Oh, they lowered the damage. I think this round used to be like six damage. Now it's only four. Where did it even show three? Let's fucking go, never win. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Oh, we're still losing. Oh my god, we're still loose leaking. Now oh, we lost. First win. Never mind. Zero blocks for me. I don't think I win even with maximum blocks. 
Ah, GG end. GG end. I might lose the keep rounds. Thank you, Griever, for the 34. Give Mango lots of treats. I always do, man. He's a spoiled dog. Spoiled animal. I'm the lowest deepest in the lobby. You see that? I'm dead last. Okay. Time for a comeback now. <coughs> My first win. Ah, we lost. Seven, six, We're not winning any fight. We lost. Four, Next three, round, we started winning. Two, one. Ah, GG ends. Maybe this guy is weak. This guy spent every penny in his fucking bank. What the shit? Alright, now we start winning. This is the round. Holy shit, what are these holes? This is new. Increase alt effect by 10%. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Holy shit, I'm actually not getting anything. Okay, we win. Uh, next round is when we start winning. Next round. This guy also only has 400 gold left. Shit, he's gonna multicast me eventually. No multicast! Lost. Okay. Now I start winning. This is the round. Fuck. Two, one. Ten, nine, eight. Okay. Six. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. This is it. Give me the weakest motherfucker in this whole lobby. Give me a cripple. Let's fucking go. Shit, I might still lose if he gets like gigabox. And I don't. 
Nah, there's no fucking way. Story skill two, burst fury. Let's go. This is it. Come back. Burst region is so good, but I have a free roll. Let's take both. I do. I need to start winning. I can't lose so much anymore. Oh, the number one. Well, what if I make him number two? Oh, I actually might make him number two. His ward is very low HP. Oh, he's fuck it. He is not fuck it. He is not fuck it at all. Oh, he has the fucking ward epic. How's Paul and Balance at all? Did they buff that? That ward seems way too good on Paul them. Kinda of annoying to buy on this round, but the combo is a bit too good. Okay, I need to stop the bleeding. I need to stop the bleeding now. I'm on the higher damage in this lobby. Oh, this guy's straight up lost. What the fuck? Looks good to me. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Popo, thank you for the seven months. Give me the entire lineup of cripples only. I only want to fight cripples. The elderly, the cripples. Give me them all. I kind of want to prioritize level 15 for the 40% bonus damage on the Guna Blade. Oh, so Dragon Slave. Holy shit, this guy's invincible. The wards are way too strong in this patch, aren't they? They overbuffed the shit out of them. 
What the fuck? Our guys. <clears throat> Three, two, one. Every round, two HP. Our guys. I can almost buy Pollen too. 1400 lifts. <clears throat> Shit, this guy doesn't take damage. Shit. No, wait, hold it, hold it, hold it. What the fuck? I'm so fucking dead. <coughs> oh my god, this guy's a legendary. Round 14. Oh my god, a round 14 legendary. This ain't it. Oh, fuck these items, too, man. Oh, Jesus. Yoga's going crits. Why oh, yeah, I'm not getting enough fury in this. It's not even contested. It's like the least picked one. I'm not getting the unlucky. Oh, I didn't see the axe nerf. That sounds good though. Now we're winning fights. Now we are winning fights. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, the, uh, the number one that fully spends same network as me, though, kinda. I fuck him anus. 
I fucking mean this. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I almost want to take that too, but... Ah, oh, fuck it, man. I can't, I can't get anymore. I'm too low HP. Let me also do it real quick. Holy fuck! What the fuck? This guy fully spent too? They upped the damage again, I think. People solo HP at around 18. It's very strange. Oh yeah, the game is really short now. I should be able to beat this guy since he's playing War 2. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? I think that Skyrath is gonna win the lobby. I'm not weak. He's just overly strong in the Skyrath. No oh boy, one HP guy. All right, another one bites the dust. My HP is slowly going up, rising like the phoenix. Let's fucking go. Two HP every round. You're going up in the rankings. Let's go, let's go! Man, these rolls are terrible, man. I don't have a fucking legendary yet. At round 20. Selena abilities? Three, sure, man. Two, one. I don't think I'm playing period today, no. I'll play it more after I finish with Horizon. It should be almost done. I'm almost beating this guy. Fuck, I have to full spend now. I'm in kill range. Gift of Liberation. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, liberated.
Wagamusi? Let's go play, man. Let's go! Give me... Give me... Give me... Legendary! Bloodthirsty Strike. What the fuck, dude? Come on. Fuck, man! Fuck! I think I am in kill range. I think the damage just change when the fight starts. Oh, no one's at 10 though. Oh, this guy's fucking dead, right? There's no way. He can't touch me anymore. He... Mm, mm, he touches real bad. Gating one out. <clears throat> well, give me one extra roll for next round. <coughs> Ten. Can't believe the Phoenix thing actually paid off. Dude, I cannot fucking do anything to this animal. What the fuck? Can someone kill him? It's one extra dragon slave, but I think I'd rather look for legendaries. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> what the fuck? Initiative Ogre killed me before anything happened. All right. Thank you, banana, banana for the 75. Can you in favor 115? Can you play party in ranked? I think so. Doesn't seem like they're very strict on it. Also, there's no there's no matchmaking. It's just the uh, random shit. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Ring, ring. The ogre build looked fair. Oh yeah, you like how it just. Deleted me <laughs> before the first auto attack flew out. I <laughs> tabbed out and I was like, what? Well, how is the fight over? I think oh, it was Ogre with, with ding initiative ding. and both get legendaries. Mm, yes. Thank you, Colored Bull, for the sub gift, man. <laughs> Twaga. <laughs> Hello. 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 Hmm. Let's do this good overlay for this. It's a private call. Ricky. <coughs> hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Get your filthy paws off my wards, uh, Wagamusi. Fuck. You think you're a tree? Get, get, get them off my wards, Waga, Increase Waga pussy. the damage taken by enemy wards. Yes. Nine, eight, I think I will. Seven. <laughs> You've been gifted a sub, Sing. I I you're subbing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, um. Tubi? 
Stop yeah. disarming. What the fuck? You're disarming before every attack. <laughs> My attack's been too slow. I can't get a hit out. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> I lo Wait, no. Hold it. Oh. oh my god. It's uh, close. Oh, perfect time of gameplay. Pretty skilled if you ask me. Ten, nine, eight. I'm gonna freeze your tree. I'm just watering it a bit, you know? Water the tree. Cold water. Watch, I can put this on the second screen. Two bay? This is me. Two bay. Two fuck you. I disarm. Dude, I, I played against him last time, it wasn't fun. Is his luck still uh, holding up? I'm disarming quite a bit. Oh. oh god. East? I'm building that losing streak, that's all I'm doing. <laughs> Treasure map? <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Lost. Three, it's... Two, Lost again. One. Uh, eagle eye. I'm testing something new. Eagle eye boost. I'm going for the seal wheel. I don't know. I think I'm gonna go all in wards. I'm gonna specialize. Like the damage reduction. Damage reduction using. again. Ward regen. All in. All in wards. Oh, you got the book? Oh, fucking rigged. Fuck yeah! I don't need the region and rotation for this. I think region is a bait on three ends. I'm just winning. I think the real winners on three ends is shield uh, and poison. I'm building losing streak gold. It's great. It's great. It's great. Yeah, it's good. Ten, nine, eight, seven, Eagle Eye Boost. Six, okay, uh, have five, fun playing against me. Four, three, two, <clears throat> one. Uh, much fun, much fun. So many people playing Void now. God, I can't win around. <laughs> Very Jesus, she's Very strong. Balanced. Insane hero. I enjoy its balance as well. So you're dating, so... No, it's no way. Three, two, 
Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, <clears throat> one. Go die and give me the wards. I got my iron branch scaling. It's all good. I'm perma scaling from this. Go die. Whoa. I Whoa. get iron branch. <laughs> <laughs> nice orb of corrosion, fucking nerd. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wards. How convenient. Don't take words. <laughs> Ubi? <laughs> what? Words. Your hands off our words. Our words. No. Did you treasure map? You piece of shit. You found it, didn't you? Yeah, I treasure map. I always uh, treasure map. I fucking hate it saying everyone just finds insta treasure maps <laughs> like oh yeah round four or some shit. Just treasure map. Oh my god. Fuck yeah. Oh my word doesn't have HP. This sucks. Cook. Suck. Warehouse shelf feels good. Hmm. Oh, feels good, man. Dual Grail, I don't mind if I do. Three, two, one. <clears throat> Fuck yeah. I am strong. Ten, nine. Eight, I'm seven, so weak. Six, I'm so five, weak. Four, Ever try three, being strong? Two, no. One. Uh, unlucky. I like how my ward is still 113 HP as well. It's like, mm -hmm. can it be bigger? Mm -hmm. I'm sure word. Dead. Oh, this one was close. And get done those for the 58 months. And strong Mirana. Oh, finally some luck. Oh, I did the wrong order. Oh my god, my 20 gold! I still haven't seen the HP upgrade. I think the whole village is going wards, yeah. And shields, apparently.
<clears throat> okay, 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 okay. It's looking pretty decent. I'm strong. My ward needs HP. That stupid HP ward uh, talent never showed up once. Was that purple book too? Every time I uh, buy the same class of item twice in a row, I get 20 gold. So if I buy poison or shield again now, Holy I get shit, 20 you gold. Lost yet, Subi? No, just, just winning. <sighs> I see you got the balanced items too? Yeah, it's slightly balanced. No. Oh shit. <laughs> Not yeah. losing and you have dual grail? Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't, don't pay attention to it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's not gonna be a problem. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be weak. Weak. That was close. <laughs> no, no, no. If not my ward died, it would have been weak, trouble. Oh, finally, here it is. Hmm, mm, yes, yes. Ten, nine, <clears throat> I'm not all that in POE. It's too hard. My build is too shit as well. Okay, <laughs> eight damage at round twelve. What the fuck? They definitely up the up the speed all the damage right everywhere. Now. I'm speed running win right now. The Pangos and Ursas are fucking strong against tree. It feels like. <laughs> hmm. Ah, oh, fuck it. Seven hundred more gold. Why not? I'm going all in more talents. I don't know if it's the right choice though. I'll see. Please. Oh god, I lost already. Hello, I got my ward. Oh my god. Hello. I got cut to pieces. Jesus. No, 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 no. This is just a normal Pangolian. No, no death here. This is the most uh, normal treasure map, Pango. Hmm. It's not looking good. They upped the player damage by way too much, I think. Jesus, man. You lose so much for losing now. I believe in you. You got this. You got it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fuck, Holy four minutes into another. Fuck, and that was close. All the ward HP in the world now. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. 
need to get level 15 next. Two, Although it doesn't help that much. It's ward region. I'm dying to injury right now. I think I'd rather rush level 50 wards. Uh, sorry, level 40 wards and then hope I get the legendary. Get the level 10 shield out to fuck this. I can't stay greedy forever. I'm, I'm taking way too much damage. Oh, let's hope I get the legendary wards. I've got a nighter so far. Shit, I outlive my wards right now. That's not good. They won't uh, explode now. <coughs> Getting so fucking destroyed. Hello, fellow tree. Are you winning? I'm fucking dead in like one of my rounds. Martyr's plate. Ah, yeah, yeah. Not like this. Yeah, you wouldn't kill one of your own. Oh. Why does yours have 1300 HP? Ah, you <laughs> fed it milk every day. <laughs> Oh, oh no. my god. Ball difference. <laughs> oh no no. Ah, I got killed by my fellow tree. Disgusting. Oh my god. Yeah. Well, uh, seventh place, not last place. We're good, we're good. <laughs> It's a win. <laughs> you still haven't lost, you fucker. Well, no, don't look at it. It's fine. I haven't gotten any legendaries, though. Three, two, one. Oh, he has the legendary. Oh. Fuck. It doesn't seem like you need uh, legendaries. No, no, no. I, I need them. <laughs> Jesus. They, they need them. Oh, I don't know his legendaries. He has the double ward at the start. That's a legendary. Unless <laughs> Palam has a talent for it, but I don't think she does. Oh, fucking hell. It's too bad. He's come for him. Oh, boy. He has pretty big balls. But, uh, oh, I don't, I don't have any legendaries. Um, oh? And you were a little dead, uh, Suka Bled. 
Oh my god, he killed me. Wins take you... over. The Grail. You're a Grail, How could mommy. you? And I'll do it again. I never find legendaries, I don't understand. I don't understand. What do you mean? I have no legendaries either. <laughs> yeah, but I've been rolling for them and I had the. Uh, I'm rolling for, for them too! <laughs> it's not like I'm not rolling for them. <laughs> I was uh, had them available for ages. But he deserves them. I deserve everything. I lost one round. I feel, I feel robbed. Yeah, it's tough, dude. It's tough being me. You might as well click the Holy Grail to be cash out now. It's just, it's it's just fifty now. <laughs> yeah, you probably won't get. I mean, look how little life there's left on the board. <laughs> You're not gonna get to four hundred. Uh, get to four hundred again. I did it once. Surely. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, <laughs> one. <laughs> <clears throat> Another ward person. Oh, he is destroying me. I'm getting saved by shields. Gold Scepter. Oh my god, I'm actually just winning with Gold Scepter. Oh, Gold Scepter is MVP in this fucking lobby. Do you win against the Mirana? <laughs> I, uh, that's the important question. I did last time, but I don't know about now. Yeah. Mirana seems pretty strong too. Ten, nine, I'm gonna eight, lose. I can seven, feel it. Six, five, no, no, no. Four, uh, anime. Three, lose. No. Two, one. no legendary. No win. Let the balls battle. What the fuck is this ball they're, they're war? Bo pulling out more balls as the fight <laughs> progresses. <laughs> oh he has God. so many legendaries, what? dudes. Yeah. It's way too much. Yeah. They should just be an anti-legendary legendary. If you count the legendaries, you must join them. Ten, nine, eight, Shit! Six, five, if only you had 200 five, gold right now, huh? Two, one. Oh. I'm sick tot. <laughs> <laughs> that was a very fitting song. Yeah, uh, that song randomly playing, uh, that's uh, that's how I feel. <laughs> you used to be top of the world, to be. Oh my god. It's gone downhill. He got Spirit Link. The fuck? Mm hmm. Huh? How can I get Armored Void again? It was already maxed out. Oh no, Armored Ward is Attack Ward, never mind. Yeah, Armored Ward is the fucking shit ability of you. No attacking. Oh, he has Spirit Link too now. He has leveled up. It's not enough! <laughs> Oh, come, Susu Toti, what a bitch. A legendary difference! I have one legendary this round, uh, this whole Top game. Two. Top two! Top two, Timmy, not dead. Ah, uh, shit. There's nothing that can save me. 
I had more legendaries than you think, and I got seventh place. <laughs> Ten. Mine were very important Eight. to get, and I didn't Seven. get them. He's got going, like, huh? he's got 10 fucking idols protecting him, dude. He can't get through that. <laughs> remake? Oh, do we have to remake? Remake, remake, remake. Remake, remake. Yeah. <clears throat> See if Steve wants to play. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Surely he does. Steve! Yeah. Let's go on this good. Yeah, yeah, go to Did I get gold for that game? I don't know. I didn't check. <clears throat> so yeah, I think we're rating now. What? Are we rating now? now? Yeah, it's eight. I thought eight was tomorrow. Sandra, are you rating? <laughs> it's Saturday, right? Oh shit! Are we rating? No. Yeah. Are you rating? Oh, you're right. Oh, I thought we decided on Sunday. I guess he changed his mind. No, we rolled between Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> you rolled for when you're gonna wait. Because there's the same amount of people that could play on both days. I see. Oh. Well, I'm declining match. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, happening? yeah, they're going raid. Good luck, uh, Warcraft Raiders. Uh, Alright, GG's. I'm done see. streaming for yeah, the day. Thank you, Matika. Uh, for the 16, and GDSR, thank you the 42. I wish you all a nice evening. I'm done for the day. Good night. Bye, bye.